Drop my bass, mash up the place. <laughs>
Hey everybody, welcome on in, welcome to the stream. How's everybody doing tonight? How's everybody spending their their chill and relaxing Sunday evening, or Monday? Again, it could be Monday, depending where you're at in the world, it could be Monday morning. But how's everybody doing? Nat, how are you doing? Uh, you're doing okay, waiting to see if you, ooh, if you lose power with this thunderstorm. Uh-oh, I hope you don't. Oh, I really hope you don't. I'm sorry that you're having, you're having a rough patch with storms. We've been having a real rough patch with storms lately. And Trixie, the one, the only Trixie. I love the music that I've I've found to do the like the the starting soon screen and when we're doing just chatting stuff. Uh, most of it's by Game Chops, which are all on Spotify. They're all DMCA free, uh, lo-fi and remixed gaming music and that kind of stuff. There's some other stuff in there, but a good majority of it is is Game Chops. Um, they make fantastic stuff. They're always coming out with new stuff. I think they just put out a new Pokemon album recently. So it's it's all fantastic stuff and it's it's safe for streamers to use on their on their streams. We've I've even gone entire streams and just left it on when we're doing like Minecraft and that kind of stuff. Seals Apple, how you doing my friend? Welcome on in. How is your Sunday? If it is Sunday for you, how is your Sunday treating you? Also, it's so good to see you. Today, tonight. We're gonna play some more Banjo Kazooie because we started. We started on an epic quest during the 12-hour stream. We started on an epic quest that we did not finish. We did not finish it in the six hours that I allotted to Banjo Kazooie during the 12-hour stream slash 14-hour stream, whatever you want to call it at this point. Um, so we're gonna we're gonna keep going, and I'm gonna go back. And now that there's not really a rush, I'm gonna focus on 100%ing the game. So I think I skipped a couple jiggies in some areas because I knew they were gonna eat up a lot of time. So we're gonna go back. We're gonna get them. 
we're gonna have a real chill evening hopefully i think i think if this is a regular five hour stream i think we can probably finish the game tonight and 100 percent it i think i'm no speedrunner, but i think we can do it all right i'm gonna switch switch glasses because i cannot see these are cool as fuck but i cannot see without my regular glasses so we're gonna switch sorry i'm going back to regular mode this weather's been crazy been all over been at over 100 degrees so the storm is inevitable but it's another bad one. Oh no man i'm so sorry to hear that we've been having like the last couple weeks we've had thunderstorms at least two or three nights a week so it's been it's been pretty crazy weather wise here too but I hope it passes quickly, and I hope that you, I definitely hope you don't lose power. That would be very unfortunate. Hopefully that's not the case. You're doing really well. I just finished making mashed potatoes. Ooh, some good old mashed potatoes. You can never go wrong with those mashed taters. I always like me some mashed taters. I'm doing really well. Thank you so much for asking. Thank you so much for asking. Also, Nat, we played uh, we played some Phasmo last night for the second half of the stream. My dear friend Empress Lily, who you'll often see in the in the chat, uh, jumped on in and we played some Phasma. We died a lot. We we got killed by a lot of ghosts. Many many ghosts killed us, but it was a lot of fun. It was it really was a lot of fun. I th I think we're both at level two now, but that's it. <laughs> also, I did have a flashlight for most of it because I kept losing my flashlight, and then I didn't have money to buy another flashlight. So, for a good majority of it, I didn't have a flashlight, and I was just kind of wandering around in the dark, yelling at the ghost. Mini ghost? What kind of, ooh, what's, what's a mini ghost? You played a few games? Hell yeah, Nat. Hell yeah. That's awesome. I think we did about, I'd say we did about 10 to 15 games. Some of them were real quick. Some of them we just died, like, immediately. The ghosts were, were really aggressive, and we just died immediately. Hell yeah, we're definitely going to do more. We're definitely going to do some more phasmophobia action. So we'll definitely be bringing in some other folks to play with us. I know Trixie expressed an interest. Um, I think the Beardy Bunch are going to do a Phasmo night one of these weeks. Tomorrow I think we're doing Rocket League again. But one of these weeks we're definitely going to do some, some Phasmo action. I'm also going to play exclusively horror games for the entire month of October. So I'm sure I'll get into some, some Phasmo then too. But without further ado, I'm going to pause Spotify. Spotify, get out of here. And we're going to play some Banjo-Kazooie. Because that's what we're here for. We're here for some Banjo-Kazooie action. And we're going to jump right back into our save file from the 12-hour stream. Um, I'm going to remind myself what stuff we skipped. Until this layer, we haven't had a chance to do that yet. Uh, we 100 percented Mumbo's Mount. It only took us 15 minutes. Treasure Trove Co. Oh, we mm, we missed we missed a honeycomb there. I don't know where that is. Hmm. I mean, we can we can go there. I don't know. I thought we got all the honeycombs in Treasure Trove. Okay. So I'm trying to remember. Hey, Zane! How you doing, my friend? How you doing today? It's so good to see you, Zane. It's always so good to see you. Uh, I think there was one over here, but I thought we got that one. Uh, maybe not. Maybe there wasn't one over there. Uh, that's a one-up over there. I'm doing fantastic. Thank you so much for asking, Zane. I'm doing really well. And I'm so happy to see you. So happy to see you and get to hang out with everyone 
again tonight. I'm always so happy when this is like the high point of my evening is when we, we pop on in, we play some games together, and there it is. Oh, fuck, there it is. This is gonna be real. This is gonna be real dangerous. B banjo, banjo, go underwater. What? Go under. There you go. Oh, we're gonna die. At least grab it before you die, Banjo. There we go. There we go. We're leaving. We're out of here. If we play fast mode, you'll find. Oh hell yeah! We didn't have we didn't have a ton of equipment because we didn't have much money. In fact, Lily was the one who had most of the equipment, because Lily did the tutorial, but I didn't. What? What do you... I don't... Continue offline, I don't care. Um, I didn't do the tutorial. So it didn't give me any equipment. Did we get all the stuff in Clanker's Cavern? Okay, 100% there, 100% there. We also missed the honeycomb in Clanker's Cavern. How was I missing all these honeycombs? I but missed both honeycombs and bubble glue? Oh. Oh, hell yeah, Nat. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. But yeah, we definitely got to get up to some more. Oh, is this, this is not the right way. Oh, but I could wake up the cauldron. We definitely have to get up to some phasmo action sometime soon. I don't think the ghosts like liked me very much though, Nat. I kept yelling at them. <laughs> Alright, so where There's one that we missed here. There's one over there, which we got that one. Oh, I, I, I may or may not have. I thought, I thought I was trying to save Lily. I had a crucifix, and there was a ghost going after her, and I was like, I'm gonna run directly into the ghost with the crucifix. I'm sure this will save her. Well, it did save her. <laughs> it didn't save me. <laughs> uh, there was one... Oh, you know what? One was on his... The one we got that was on his tooth. Hey, Jinto! How you doing, my friend? It's so good to see you, Jinto. It's always so good to see you. It's so good getting to hang out in your stream today. I'm doing fantastic. Thank you so much for asking. I'm having a fantastic day. I'm trying to... I'm trying to find the stuff that we missed last time. Which are mostly all the... The honeycomb pieces. Just a light. Mm. There's one inside one of those, isn't there? Let me get that one. I thought there was one. I thought the two in this area were. His teeth are back in. 
was it? No, you know what? It's a mumbo token that's in there. So the second one might be in one of the the underwater tunnels. Hey, how you doing? How are you today, Kay? How is your day treating you? You're finally here, hell yeah! That's what we like to see. Oh. Ooh, chaos pack, hell yeah! Let me get you a chaos pack, Kay. Alright, gift pack. Chaos pack. One card. Two. Kay. There you go, you got it inbound, headed your way. There you go. How you doing today, Kay? I think there's a... This is where the, the jiggy appears. There's not... There's not a honeycomb piece in here. Just regular heavy guns. Ooh, and one for Jinto. Hell yeah. Oh, okay. It's never it never hurts to take a take a day off and just relax. It definitely never hurts to take a take a day off to relax. There you go, Jinto. You got a pack inbound courtesy of Nat. Alright, so there's not one in here. That's what we like to see. Gifted stream loot packs, that's what it's all about. I'm always blown away by the, the generosity of the folks in the community here. Oh, okay, so it's not that one. Is it the one? Where does this one? This one, I think, goes to a grape. Hang on, we need air. But it could also be... Because I know there was one in here. Did I get this one? in there. Oh, that's a life. Yeah, it was in there was one in there. That's the one we got. We were waiting for 5k. Ooh. For a gift a pack to everybody redeem. I think that's the price of the gift a pack to everyone. There's so many places because it could be in here. Forgot there's like a whole there's this whole inside to him. Last night was hilarious with uh with Gardic Phone or with Phasmo. Um what what part of last night are you referring to, Kay? Or all of the above? I hope, I hope you enjoyed all of the above. Oh, Phasmo, hell yeah! Oh, we'll definitely play some more Phasmo. We'll definitely get into some more Phasmo action. I'm really glad to hear they enjoyed it. That's really awesome. I'm really glad, because we were having a ton of fun. Oh, 
There's a Jinjo down here. I don't remember where this freaking honeycomb piece that we missed was. I know there was one in that pipe that we got already. I don't know where... Wait, is there like... One of these have like an underwater section that you can like swim up into. Oh, here we go. This, It's coming back to me. There it is. I have like a flash in my memory of it. No, no, hey, whoa, 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 grab the freaking, it's hard to see, <laughs> just grab it, there we go, there we go, it had like a flash of where it was, ooh, congrats K and the Seal's Apple on the Chingling, Chingling, that's a that's a real catchy name for a Pokemon. Mmm, chili, huh? Savage Jacob 54. Thank you so much for that follow. I really appreciate it. How you doing, my friend? Welcome on into the stream. It's so good to have you here. Oh, hey! Buddy, I'm just trying to leave. Get out of here. I'm just trying to leave. I got my honeycomb piece. I'm ready to go home. Uh oh, uh oh, oh. I thought I miscalculated the jump. I'm doing fantastic. Thank you so much for asking, Jacob. I really appreciate it. Are you, uh, are you a fan of Banjo Kazooie? Is that what, what's led you to us today? Because this is my all-time favorite game. We started playing it for our, our big 12-hour celebration stream. Um, but we didn't finish it in the, the time that I allotted to it. So we're back at it again. We're playing some more Banjo-Kazooie action. Which I'm really happy. Uh, we're going to go back to Bubble Gloop. Because I missed a Jiggy there, and apparently I missed both. Oh, hey, hey, hey. None of that. Do the pop-up cards appear in front of you on the side? They pop up on the on the stream, which is right over to the right of me. Which is where Chad is. So they pop up on the screen where Chad is. You wouldn't, you wouldn't have to have a spider card, do you, Kay? I'm nervous. I'm real nervous. You know how I feel about those spider cards. Sir? Sir, thank you for the lurk. I really appreciate it, sir. <laughs> okay. You wouldn't do that to me, would you? You wouldn't... You wouldn't scare me with a spider, would you? <laughs> As the ultimate terrorizer of everybody on Twitch. <laughs> sir? I mean, it is, it is one of our emotes. Did I miss one in any of these? Okay, I gotta find... I gotta find the... The honeycomb pieces. Found me on TikTok, hell yeah! I don't use TikTok so often. TikTok's like my least used. I, I pop on there once in a while. Uh, I primarily only use Instagram and Snapchat. They're about the only social medias that I use. But I got some clips on there. In fact, I keep meaning to put another clip up. Because I was trying to do like one clip a week kind of deal, and then I forgot about it. You have to change back into an alligator. Or a crocodile. I think it's a crocodile. So we'll do that and we'll keep an eye out for honeycomb pieces. 
because we're missing two of those in this level. I always feel bad because Dad always sends a ton of, of of TikToks, and I almost never check it. Are there any? Uh, no. All right. Transform me. might make it easier to search because we can we can just wander through the the swamp but i feel like there's gonna be one like on top of one of these poles hey hey you piece of shit get out of here all right i feel like there's gonna be one like on top of one of these things we missed both of them in this area I, I have Facebook. I just don't use it too often. Uh, I I use it more when I when I release new books. I use social media a lot more because I use it for like marketing and advertising and stuff. But normally I just don't I don't use them a ton. I do enjoy Instagram's fun sometimes because you most of the pages I'm following on Instagram are like meme pages. So I'll pop on, I'll, I'll get a couple memes, and then I'll hit the road. He's, he's got, look at, look at him running around with his mouth. He's got to be eating a lot of swamp water. Just think of all the swamp water he must be ingesting. All right, we do have to do... We we gave up on the... The, uh, the alligator race. Or crocodile race. Whatever they are. All right, this time... This time, Mr. Vile, you're going down. I'm making some steady progress on the next book, Nat. Um, I'm, I've been, I've been pumping out about a chapter a day. Um, I think I'm shooting for maybe a November, December release for book number three. Wait, can we use? Wait, can we use the speedy? Oh my god, we can use the speedy shoes. Oh my god, we can look at our adorable little shoes. I didn't realize that you could use the speedy shoes as as the crocodile. Oh, this changes everything. We're so speedy. We're such a speedy boy. We're almost too speedy. Yeah, I had no idea. I always wondered why they were there. And apparently they just last forever. Hotline, how you doing, my friend? Oh my god, this changes everything. We're decimating them. Yeah, get the hell out of here. That's my red grumbly. <laughs> I had no idea you could use the shoes. <laughs> Alright, we gotta eat, eat red, avoid yellow grumblies. Not right. Ready? Three, two, one. Give me my shoes. Where are all the reds? Oh. 
No, you're almost too fast with it. I mean, he's he's still. Oh, it's because I keep fucking missing. No! I still lost! <laughs> oh no. Grab the shoes, we're gonna escape! We're gonna make a quick getaway! Oh my god, he gets faster! No! 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 Oh my god, I escaped! I escaped! Is he gonna be waiting? Is he gonna be waiting to attack me when I go back in there? Oh, I'm so scared now. Is he gonna be waiting there? <laughs> Mr. Vile! I'm sorry. Oh, am I gonna have to do the first round over again now? Oh, I'm gonna have to do the first round over again, aren't I? Oh, no. I don't want to play the easy game. Oh, so if you run away from him, it makes you do the easy game again. Oh my god. So the shoes almost make you too fast. Yeah, how about that, Mr. Vile? That was the easy game, though. Oh, you weren't trying. Oh. My favorite is when you just steal one, like, literally right out of his mouth. Oh no! Oh, alright, I'm gonna let him attack me because otherwise I'm gonna have to keep doing the first game. Yeah, like, no worries, Zane. I hope you're doing okay, my friend. It was so good to see you. It's always so good to see you, Zane. Thank you for stopping by. I really appreciate it. Oh, no, Zane. I'm really sorry to hear that. I hope you have a chance to go do something relaxing and unwind for the rest of your, uh, the rest of your day. I'm so sorry to hear that, my friend. No! Oh, I still beat him. Okay.
No, come on. I'm gonna change. No! Count if it's a tie. Oh no, mighty Mr. Bile. Alright. Alright. Let me have it. Change the red. There we go. No! with them. Oh, I thought we had one more. Oops. That's okay. We gotta look for honeycomb pieces. Also, I don't know. I don't know if we climbed any of this stuff. No, oh, there's feathers up there. Because we're still missing two honey honeycomb pieces in this area, too. have even the faintest recollection of where the honeycomb pieces are in this world. That's a feather. Ooh, I wonder if there's one in the turtle. I feel like there's not, but there might have been. I don't think there's any up here. missing both of them. Oh wait, is one of them on top of the egg? And you have to break it to a certain point to get up to it. Well, nope, that's an extra life. Darn, I thought maybe that was one of them. Because I know that was the case with the totem pole in the first world. You could miss the, the honeycomb piece if you broke the totem pole all the way down.
Hey, Dean, how you doing, my friend? Welcome on back. How you doing today? So good to see you. How's your Sunday been treating you? Hell yeah. Hell yeah, that's what it's all about. I'm really glad to hear it. That's fantastic. No worries, Nat. We'll be here. We're going to be here for a couple more hours, so you got nothing to worry about. Thank you for hanging out, Nat. I really appreciate it. Where are these freaking... I'm fantastic. I mean, I try. What, what have I done? What have I done that's made me fantastic, Kay? <laughs> I mean, I'm not denying it. I try really hard, but... <laughs> Is there is there a specific reason? No, no, no. I don't. I I don't know about that. Martian, Martian Legend, God King, my friend, my friend. How are you doing? We're gonna we're gonna race this alligator slash crocodile. I don't I don't know. But before that, we're gonna take a look around the room. We're gonna make sure he's not hiding any honeycomb pieces in here. No. Martian! <laughs> yeah, well, the, there's clearly there's gonna be a war between the beavers and the raccoons. It's just it's just a thing. It's gonna happen. There's no doubt that it's gonna happen. Just wait. In in like ten years when it happens. I'm, I'm gonna come back, and I'm gonna tell you that I told you so. Uh, I'll be a hologram by then, because 20 years from now, there'll be holograms. So Twitch will be outdated. Instead, I'll be a hologram playing video games instead of just on a video. I'm gonna say I told you so about the, the beavers and, and the raccoons going to war. Mr. Vile, Mr. Vile, you should have just stayed home. You're not even trying. Uh oh, he's catching up. Uh oh, he's catching up. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Uh oh. Alright, cool. Uh, why are the va the beavers and the va the raccoons going to war? There's 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 some real bad blood between the beavers and the raccoons. Hotline. Uh, <laughs> I forget the exact story. There's a whole story. Okay, do you remember the entire the entire story that I provided for why the beavers and the raccoons were going to war? No, no, stop, stop eating my grumblies. Those are my grumblies. My grumblies. Ooh, that's that's a that's a solid reason, Dean. Those dang beavers blocking off the raccoon's water supply. That's a real solid reason. Get away from my grumblies. Get away! They're mine! They're all mine! You can't have any of them! Speedy boy shoes. Oh, is it gonna change? Okay, it's gonna change. Ah! Oh, stole right out of his mouth! That's what we like to see. Yeah! No, I ate the wrong one. I was going too fast. This, is, this must be how Sonic feels. No! <laughs> Alright, the shoes are actually a little bit counterproductive. Because <laughs> you go too fast and then you eat like three of them with one bite. No! Oh, okay, cool. 
Healthy Martian Young wants to recommend the following game, The House in the Woods. Ooh, The House in the Woods. That sounds familiar, Martian. What is The House in the Woods? I feel like I've heard of that game. No, we're tied again! Oh, it's free. Oh, I like free. The House in the Woods. Let me write it down. We've got we've got a bunch of them now. Because um, a couple nights ago, Milnus recommended Pokemon Conquest. The House in the Woods. Uh, and then last night, Billy redeemed one for 12 minutes. The best free horror game. Ooh, hell yeah, Martian. You know how I feel about horror games. You gotta go fast. You always gotta go fast. Sonic Speed. The raccoons were eating out of the trash for years and discovered, discovered what? They discovered, they discovered the beaver's oh, terrible secret. Genetically altered cyborg beavers. That they were also hiding in the trash. Because they were ashamed. They were ashamed of what they'd created. I just want to beat. I just want to beat this crocodile. <laughs> the Martian Young says, "Hands up for thirty seconds." No, Martian, you've doomed me. You've doomed me, Martian. No. You've doomed me. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> oh, no, look at him go. He's on a feeding frenzy. <laughs> a feeding frenzy like none that's ever come before. <laughs> Ooh, genetically altered glizzies are where it's at. They're even more delicious. Yeah, well, their, their secret weapon is the most delicious glizzy in the world. They, uh, they, they trick their enemies... They trick their enemies into in eating into eating the glizzy, and then then their enemies just they they just can't stop. They gotta keep eating. That's that's when the the true feeding frenzy starts. Dean Winchester two hundred wants you to play with one hand for fifteen seconds. Oh fuck! Seconds. I can't eat things with one hand. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Oh, I can only run around. <laughs> All right, we get it. We gotta make up for last time. Eat those, eat those grumblies. Eat the grumblies. No, that's the wrong grumbly. <laughs> we're we're trying to we're trying to we're trying to beat this freaking crocodile. <laughs> We're trying to eat more. Oh, fuck, I ate the wrong one. Now we're also at war with the crocodiles. Slash alligator. I don't know what they are. Oh. Alright, we got one more chance. Alright, come on. Ready. All right, get that. Yeah. Oh no, now they're yellow. Get the yellows. No, no, don't go away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, it's gonna turn around. Ah! Get away from my grumblies. They're my grumblies. No, no, no! Oh, fuck, it changed to red! Alright, alright, alright. Hold on. Yellow. Yeah, 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 get the yellow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Grab that one. Don't let him get him. Yeah, don't let him get him. There we go. Oh my god. Oh my god, are we gonna do it? Are we gonna do it? Yes! We did it! This is the happiest I've ever been at eating excessive amounts of worms. 
no, no. Th three extra like no 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 thank you that sounds like a terrible deal yeah that sounds like a terrible deal get the hell out of here <laughs> why would we choose to do that to ourselves more oh Dean congrats on the berserker um, I gotta figure out where the honeycombs are now. I'm missing two honeycombs in this area. And I don't know if I need to be an alligator to get them. I feel like there might be one in inside the turtle. Yeah, the the raccoons the raccoons are at war with, with the alligators now. Two K. Some crazy stuff has happened. Uh, there's been there's been a real a real change there's been a real change of hands and now the raccoons are going to war with the alligators. Oh no, Martian! Oh no, I'm so sorry. I mean, technically it does do something. It plays it plays a cricket sound. <laughs> okay, I'm so sorry that the that, that the raccoons are just really shooting for. Her dominance over the entirety of the animal kingdom. The raccoons just want to stand on top of the world. <laughs> no, 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 Hotline, I would never. <laughs> I would never do that. I would never do that. That's right. I would never lie to you, Hotline. <laughs> this is all... Th these are all hard facts. I'm just trying to make sure that everybody's woke to the future Raccoon War. <laughs> yeah, we've already, we've already taken our place on top of the alligators. Just to assert our dominance. <laughs> I mean, I'm kind of on the raccoon side. I like I like to think myself something of a raccoon myself. <laughs> if I were an animal, I'd probably be a raccoon. Let's be let's be honest. No, okay. I don't I don't think you would lie to Hotline. I don't think anyone could lie to Hotline, because Hotline is such an amazing individual. Oh wait, what's back here? Oh. That's helpful. Not what I was looking for, but still helpful. Ooh, hell yeah, Dean. Dean, would your would your wolf self come to the aid of the raccoons in their time of need? Can we count on you in the in the ensuing battle against the beavers? <laughs> the alligators. <laughs> oh, hell yeah. Hell yeah. Wait, it's not up on top of his house, is it? Hell yeah, that's that's what I'm talking about. Oh. Alright, so I don't think it's over here. Is it down here? No. You're part bird! That's really cool. It'd be really cool to fly. I bet flying would be a really cool thing to be able to add to your repertoire. Where are the freaking honeycomb pieces? I'm almost positive there's one in the turtle. But that still leaves another one that I have no idea where it is. Oh, 
So he just has shoes. Maybe it's over there on the let's check the let's check inside the turtle. Uh, no, I can't say that I have. Have you, Hotline? Alright, please tell me there's a honeycomb. Oh! Look at it! It's like perfectly framed for us! <laughs> it's like it knew! It's like, please, Banjo, take me. Take me into your warm, bare embrace. No, you've missed. Try again. There we go. Alright, one more. There's another one in this level somewhere. Right? Or is I wrong about missing both of them? Nope, we're still missing one. And then, freeze easy peek! We just need one more, and I think that's the one that we need the shoes for. And we've got the shoes now. We've got plenty of friends that have. Ooh, I imagine it's a really gamey taste. I imagine that would be one of those animals that would have a real gamey chewiness to their meat. Right, I'm gonna check on the bottoms first. Make sure they're not like hidden down here. I'm not, I'm not seeing any honeycombs. Or honeycomb pieces, rather. So we're gonna go up top. That's something a raccoon eater would say. Oh no! Is it up there? It has to be up here. It must be like on top of. Alright, so wait, before we break each one of these, let's see if it's like. We have to jump off of the, the hut before you smash it. Forgot what I just said. Okay, thank goodness. Oh, maybe it's not up here. It's not up here. Where the hell is it? I mean, it's up here. That's where the Jiggy was. Uh-oh. Yeah, that's where the Jiggy was. You're not... No, no, Hotline's allowed to eat raccoon. Why, why would Hotline not be allowed to eat raccoon? There's lots of people that eat raccoon. I don't, I don't think it's a common thing. But, um, I, I know there's people that eat raccoon, just like, there's a lot of people that eat squirrel, but that's not a common thing to go to the, like, the grocery store to get. Was it over there? Wait, give me those shoes. Hello? It's just a, it's just a life. I got real excited. I saw the gold. I thought that was going to be it. I mean, chickens are pretty cute, but they're also delicious. <laughs> I do happen to think chickens are adorable, but I still eat them at least once a week. What the fuck is this last? We got one in there. I doubt they put another one this close to the turtle. They have bellies and ar little arm. Well, I mean, <laughs> I think all animals have bellies. 
<laughs> I don't think that's something that's like unique to any one animal in particular, okay? I'm, I'm pretty sure all animals have bellies. <laughs> <laughs> I do agree. I agree that the raccoons are cute. If given the opportunity, though, I would I would definitely try some raccoon meat because I bet it's really good. What is on this? Is there anything on here? Oh, well, that's also helpful, but not. Is it like? It's just a jiggy in here, which we already got. Yellow trash pandas. <laughs> uh, no, I don't think it's over here. Get me out of here, leaf. I like that though, trash panda. That's a that's a cool nickname. That's a real cool nickname for for any animal. They sound like the like the punk rock animals of the animal kingdom the trash pandas that could be a band name probably somewhere over here I'm right by the entrance and I'm forgetting where Cause this air, this level's not even that big. I don't know where I could be missing the last one. <laughs> I don't know about that, Kay. <laughs> I mean, I'm cu I'd be curious what they taste like. <laughs> Yeah, now now Hotline's got me curious. We'll have like a for 500 followers, we'll have a we'll, we'll have a a, a raccoon barbecue. <laughs> the 500 follower raccoon barbecue. It'll just be me sitting outside grilling up a raccoon. <laughs> Be like in a lawn chair, fuck, with my uh, what what is what is the thing that they put on the kiss kiss the chef? I think that's what they they put on the the grilling aprons. I'll have my kiss the chef grilling apron on, and we'll just we'll just hang out while we while we grill a raccoon. Wait, there's nothing over here. There's, there's nothing over here. Where is this freaking... Oh. Uh, where is the lab? It's gotta be. Where else could it possibly be? I thought that was it. Moving over here. Alright, hang on. Bubble gloop swamp. Bubble gloop swamp. Honeycomb pieces. Bubble, gloop, swamp, honeycomb, pieces. Oh no, 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 this is a video. No, thank you. Bubble, gloop, swamp. Jiggy one, we got all the jiggies. Jiggies are done. Honeycomb piece one, it's in Mumbo. Oh, it's in Mumbo's freaking hut. I never would have checked Mumbo's hut. I'm really glad I looked it up. It's in Mumbo's hut. I'm just sure I looked around Mumbo's hut. Uh, 
Ooh, Seal's Apple. Congrats on the... Ooh, Lily Pup. I really like a Lily Pup. Lily Pup's a solid Pokemon. it in here. There it is. I think I only looked on the on the shelf, because that's where stuff usually is in here. There we go. And that's an extra an extra honeycomb. <laughs> alright, alright. The raccoon barbecue we'll we won't have a raccoon barbecue. Don't worry, Kay. It'll be it'll be too cold for the raccoon barbecue by the time we hit we hit 500 followers. Cuz it'll probably be it'll probably be fall by the time we get to that point. And we just got to get out. And then we're going we're going to the snowman land, where no man has ever snowed before. That was not funny. <laughs> Ooh, 180. Oh, shit. That's a lot of Pokemon, Apple. 189 of, of 898. Which, once, once Legends Arceus comes out, that's going to be at least 900, because they've already shown us two new Pokemon in Legends Arceus. But I wouldn't be surprised if there's more than two new Pokemon in the game. Well, you're in a bat with another guitar string. You might... You might have the most out of everyone in our stream. I'm not sure. I know Martian has a lot, and I know Lily has a lot. Oh, I fell in the water. Oh, no. I'm stuck in the water. Get out of the water. No, let me out. No, no, stop, stop chewing on my feetsies. There we go. Oh, hell yeah, Apple. I, I want to see you win. I absolutely want to see you win. Wait, <laughs> wait, who thinks I killed Larry because I wanted to barbecue a raccoon? Larry was a llama. <laughs> Larry was a llama, okay? <laughs> I mean, I wouldn't I wouldn't name the raccoon that I was going to I was going to grill up. Once you name something, you can't you can't eat it. That that needs to be like a rule. Although I don't think I think farmers name cows before they like I think they name their chickens too. So I guess that's not true. Because I think there are certain places that you can go where when you buy the beef, it's like, this beef came from... This beef came from... Melissa the Cow. <laughs> no, no, I would never, I would never, never kill Larry. No, 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 Larry, Larry was a casualty of, of a cruel and heartless accident. It was a cruel and heartless accident that I, I had no control over. I had no control over over Larry the Llama's death. I swear. It wasn't me. See you later, Kay. Thank you so much for hanging out. I really appreciate it. I do. I do fancy race, but where are my running shoes? Oh, they're right there. Okay. 
All right, don't worry. All right, you got this. Don't worry, bud. All right, I don't. Yeah, we're just gonna run through the the little gates. I got it. I'm gonna grab my shoes. Speedy boy. Speedy boy. Bump me. Don't you dare bump me. Don't you dare. No! You pushed me in the water! I lost my speedy shoes! You piece of shit. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. 15% mine. I'll, you know what? I'll accept 15%. 80% Billy's sounds about right. <laughs> <laughs> See you later, Kay! <laughs> How dare you just push me into the water? No, I missed it! Oh no. Oh no, I don't know if I can recover from this. Oh, I recovered. Oh, I've recovered significantly. All right, you stay back there. Don't you dare. You get away from me. I don't trust you on bridges anymore. Get away from me. No! Oh no, he's gonna win. He's too far ahead. No! No, we gotta take him. Yeah. Ah, 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 ah. No! We were so close. <laughs> we are disappointed we are. We're like, oh. He's like, come on, buddy. Let me kick your ass again. Look like a turkey. <laughs> well, the. I have I have a bird in my backpack. That that's the so that's Kazooie. Kazooie's a Breagle. I don't think a Breagle is a real kind of bird. I think they made Breagles up. But Kazooie lives in my backpack. Are you there? No, you never push me in the water. He's too far behind. He'll never catch up. He'll never catch up. Did he catch up? Uh-oh. No, I won. Oh, I've lost again. Take my other medal. I'm off to look for my kids' presents. I already found your kids' presents years ago, buddy. You're a terrible father. I'm their dad now. <laughs> why did the music stop? Uh-oh, wait. Why did all the sounds stop? Uh-oh, what happened? We lost sound for some reason. I'm not sure why we lost sound, but I'm going to collect this jiggy before I figure it out. I don't know if we've lost sound in general. I think we lost sound in general. Uh oh. Wait, hang on. Let's let this finish out. Oh, we lost sound for some reason. Hmm. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna get out of the level so it saves, and then I'm gonna figure out what's going on with the sound. We were just too good for the game. We broke the game. Is it? Is it only the game? Like if I do? Yeah, I can do Spotify and it still works. So it's just the. For some reason, it's the Xbox. Uh, how do we get into the level over here? Okay, 
Let me get out of the level and then I'm going to reset my Xbox. See if that's what it is. Oh, Dean, thank you so much. Thank you. It was the it was the belief of everyone in chat that carried me through. Is this going to come back? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This doesn't seem good. Uh. Uh-oh. <laughs> uh. Uh oh! All right, hang on. Restart console. <laughs> I hope that saved. <laughs> oh, there was sound on the menu. All right, hang on. We're restarting because I don't know what happened. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna hang out over here until I figure out if the if the console's gonna actually reset. Because I don't, I'm not 100 percent sure what it's doing. It's doing some stuff. But how's everyone doing tonight? How y'all, how y'all doing? The Xbox probably feels pretty, pretty neglected because I don't, I almost never use my Xbox. Oh, I don't, I don't know what it, oh, there we go, it's turning on. There we go. You're feeling crazy. I'm always feeling crazy. That's my natural state of being. Crazy is my natural state of being. I was born that way. Uh, I've just got some delicious Dr. Pepper in cream soda um, that I've been enjoying. Very much so. It's a very smooth beverage. Uh, it's taking the Xbox a long time to turn on. I'm a little bit nervous. We may we may end up playing something else if this doesn't. Oh, seems like it's working. Mmm, chilly, huh? Night Owl. How you doing, my friend? Welcome on in. Thank you so much for that follow. It's so good to have you here. How you doing, my friend? We're, we're trying to get back into Banjo-Kazooie. My Xbox freaked out. Um, so hopefully we're going to play some more Banjo-Kazooie. And hopefully that that Jiggy saved. All right, here we go. Here we go. It's back on again. So what happens when I don't use my Xbox for, for months at a time? It just feels neglected and it's like, Oh, you want to play me now? It's been It's been three months since you've even looked at me. Oh, it is really yummy. I, I highly recommend the Dr. Pepper and Cream Soda. Okay, we got sound again. Everything seems like it's working. Although, I don't know if that... There seemed like there was an issue with that, so I don't... I don't know if... If it saved. I'm mildly concerned that that Jiggy didn't save. We might have to do that race again. Let's take a look at our totals. All right, we're gonna kill this lair, Mumble Mountain, Treasure Trove, Clanker Cavern, Bubble Gloop Swamp. Uh, oh no, it did save. Okay, so we're done with Freeze Easy Peak. Now we're going back to Gobi's Valley, which is one of my least favorite levels. Actually, it's probably my least favorite level period in the whole game. You're doing good. Hope you are too. I'm a huge. Oh, Banjo Kazooie is my all-time favorite game from my childhood. So I'm really glad to hear that. What uh, what's your favorite level in Banjo Kazooie, Night Owl? My favorite is, uh, hmm, it's tough picking a favorite. I'd say it's toss up between Mon Mad Monster Mansion and, uh, oh crap, I'm blanking on, um, Click Clock Woods is good too, but I don't think that one would be in my favorites. Um, Rusty Bucket Bay. I think Rusty Bucket Bay is my favorite because I really like the music in Rusty Bucket Bay. Oh no, I don't. I don't blame you, Dean. How uh, how early how early do you have to be up for work tomorrow? Hopefully, it's not an early morning for you. I'm not a I'm not a morning person myself, so I hate those early mornings. All right, I need the shoes to get to Gobi's Valley. Give me those shoes. Ooh, that's real early. I'm so sorry to hear that, Dean. Honestly, that was around the time I went to bed this morning. <laughs> I'm I'm terrible at at like getting to bed at a at a reasonable human hour. All right, so we're back. 
We're back, baby. Um, we gotta find... I don't remember. I know we did the tree one. I think we did some of the... I think we did the one with the running shoes to get up to the top of the, the pyramid. Mm, well, you know which one we didn't do? We didn't do the... We have to do this one. But we also didn't do this one over here. And I also think there's notes in the water now, because we've... Ooh, Bubble Gloop Swamp? Oh! I'm, uh, I'm actually not too fond of Bubble Gloop. Bubble Gloop's one of the one of the levels I'm not too fond of. But, I, I mean, all the levels in this game are solid. There's, there's not a single level in this game that's not solid. Yeah, what what is going to bed at a reasonable hour? I don't know, Trixie. We're all we're all late night DJs here. <laughs> don't get me wrong, I love my sleep. I just I don't I don't sleep when normal people sleep. Alright, so we gotta shoot we gotta shoot eggs into the little statues here. that what about the uh I, I i don't know i think it's a crocodile the crocodile transformation how do you how do you feel about the the transformation in bubble Blue? because i really like that's one of my favorite things about that level is the transformation One or is there one more? Oops, oh, last one. There's also a mumbo token, which I don't remember how many mumbo tokens we need for Click Clock Woods, because that's the only one we still need them in. We already bought it. We already got the transformation in Mad Monster Mansion. King Sandy Butt. This is King Sandy Butt's tomb. Turn back or something. I didn't read fast enough. Oh, this is the maze. Mm. You've chosen not to heed our warnings. Prepare to run. I'm always prepared to run. Oh, I missed the switch. Fuck. I survived and I immediately went back in. He's like, what the fuck is this bear doing? He escaped. But there's a switch over here. Hey, Furry Lolita. Ooh, this is your favorite out of both games, Night Owl. Ooh, in the second game, I really like the carnival. Um, I think it's... Uh, I'm trying to think. Witchy World? I really like the carnival level. Although I remember the Saucer of Peril was one of the, the earliest rage quit moments for me as a kid. How you doing, my friend? It's always so good to see you. Oh, just woke up. Good morning, my friend. Hopefully, uh, you got a good night's sleep, because that's what it's all about. Sleep? What the fuck? Speaking of sleep, <laughs> speaking of sleep, we've got Sleepy. Sleepy, how you doing? Oh, a chaos pack. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, let's get sleepy a chaos pack. Chaos pack. One card for sleepy. There you go, sleepy. You got a pack incoming. Yep, 
Yeah, that was from those that was from Friday. You'd use the most cards last week. I didn't uh, I didn't have a chance to send them out until yesterday. Oh no. <laughs> what did you what did you do to Peyton? <laughs> what did you do to Peyton, Sleepy? <laughs> <laughs> and he modded he went along with that wow <laughs> um i don't remember i think i missed i don't know stop we're not trying to get uh okay there's no notes there i can't remember if i got all the notes there because i know there's a bunch of notes on that path and that i miss most of them when i'm trying to run up there with the speed boy shoes Wait, what's in this one this one... Oh, Grunty. Grunty, I think you, I think your race was a little bit too easy. Uh. Grunty's race was uh, not really much of a race at all. Oh, Dean, have a fantastic evening, my friend. I hope you get a great night's sleep, and I hope you have a great day at work tomorrow. Thank you so much again for stopping by. I really appreciate it. Night, Dean. Oh my god, it was, a, it was this one. No. Wait, did I even see that one yet? Wait, I don't even think I saw that one yet. Oh no, oh no, it's going horribly! Oh, this one's down here. This one's like right here. Boom. Uh, oh, I don't know if I saw it. Did I see Kazooie? There we go, Kazooie. Uh, that one's right here. No, it's not. It's right here. Feather. I don't think I've seen Feather. Oh, that one's right here. Music note, I think, is right here. Feather is right here. Boom. Teach your teach oh sleepy you're ask are you asking sleepy to teach you their secrets? Why do you get mods in every stream you're in? <laughs> oh no! <laughs> it was a tie between yes and yeah. It usually is a tie between yes and yes. That's usually how it works out. <laughs> All right, so we need three more, three more jiggies, three more jiggies. Uh, okay, so I need to fly. Where? I think it's over here. There's a bunch of stuff we have to fly for. Oh, I also need. Oh, wait. I need Speedy Boy shoes to get that one. Right, here we go. Speedy Boy shoes. Fuck. Come on, Puck. Is he not come back up? Wait until the unit now. Did I, did I grab it? Wait. I thought I had it. No. There we go. No, I had that a thousand years! Well done, mortal! Balloon Lords 2244. Welcome on into the stream and thank you so much for that follow. How you doing, my friend? Are you also a fan of Banjo Kazooie? Is that how you found your way to us tonight? Oh, fuck. Get out of here. 
so good to have you here. Well, Martian, that, that should work in your advantage, too, because you're a fantastic person yourself, so you shouldn't have to worry about that. Alright, here we go. We gotta fly! Because I'm pretty sure the last two are flying ones. Oh, there's some notes over there. Oh, where does that come... There's over there. Oh, you just fly there. I don't know why I'm thinking so hard about it. I could just go get the flying pad and fly there. Or I can jump on it literally right here. It's gonna disappear. No, oh fuck, I thought it was gonna disappear. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, now we're in trouble. Uh-oh. No, Martian, I, I have never once seen you that way. You're always, you're always a pleasure to have around, Martian. Alright, I want those, those boots. Oh. Crap, grab the boots. I don't care about the life, but I do want. I don't know why the number 12 is appearing in my head when I think of the number of mumbo tokens we need in, tick in Click Clock Woods. Sleepy has been following for 5 months, 12 days, and 21 hours. Sleepy, you absolute legend. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Beautiful. Like a professional. And I missed Martian Legend King God's been following for five months, twelve days, and nineteen hours. Whoa, you guys I keep forgetting that. I'm, I keep forgetting that you guys followed on the same day. Hell yeah. I appreciate both of you so freaking much. Two hours longer. Hey. It, it's still been, it's still been five months and 12 days of fantastic times. Probably. Oh, Night Owl, if you do exclamation point pokey start, um, you'll get your starter Pokemon and then you can start catching Pokemon in the chat. No, that's okay. Oh, a thousand thanks, my friend. His stuff will now help you with your quest. Yeah, it was probably either that or Billy Billy used to shout me out all the time um, in his streams because I was always over there at the the late, late hours. The late, late hours that were not late hours for uh, for Billy because Billy lives in Australia. But for us, they were late hours. All right here. It's going to come over here. And then I'm going to jump on it and we're going to go up there. We're going to get those notes. 
Ooh, I gotta fix the. I I still have forgotten. I have to fix the the spam bros command. Uh oh, I've made a horrible mistake. Yeah, I gotta fix the spam bros command. No, what do you what do you mean it's fixed? <laughs> the Martian Young is not is it, not Martian's name anymore. Yeah, that one, that one will probably never be fixed. <laughs> Yeah, it doesn't it doesn't link to Martian's account anymore. Cause Martian is Martian Legend King God now. Uh even if you're even if you're a mod, you wouldn't be able to do it sleepy. It has to be done through the, the Nightbot site. So even if you were a mod, you wouldn't be able to do it. <laughs> I, I respect the attempt, though. Crap, crap, get it. Oh, no. I think that's, is that the last one? I still have the, um, oh, I don't have either one of them. Oh, I see the switch for one of them over there. But I don't have either one of the. Oh, come on. No, get in there. Oh, come on. There we go. It? Do I, have to do I gotta do it three times, don't I? Ugh. Three is the magic number in this game. Hi. We're gonna die. Does it not? Does backwards not count? Oh my god, are you kidding me? There you go, three. What? Is it, is it not three? What? Oh no, is this... Hang on, this is where... That's not for a... Oh, that's not for a Jiggy. That's for... Oh, I know what that is. Damn it. It's this thing. You hit the switch over here and then you gotta fly. You gotta jump through there or fly through there to get one of the honeycomb pieces. I thought I had to fly through there to get a... So where is the last... I'm trying to think where the last Jiggy in this area is. We're still missing one, aren't we? Hashtag spam bros deserve mod. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna go through and I'm gonna see because I know we have some mods that aren't active anymore. So we might... I might add some more... I might add some more mods in the near future. I wouldn't do it midstream. But I'll take a look and I'll see who we have who's not really active anymore. We went in there. We 
Went in there. Went in... What is this one? We went in there. Switch again. Uh, wait, where is the switch? Oh, over here. Pack for Sleepy. Let's get Sleepy a pack of stream loot. There you go, Sleepy. Oh, you're dead. Uh oh, are you encroaching on uh on ATM Zero's territory? Super Saiyan boy. Look at that boy. Look at him going Super Saiyan. He just, he just played uh, the, you know, Super Super Saiyan, the Super Saiyan Creamin card. It really brings me back to my childhood and some really intense moments. Some really intense moments from my childhood. <laughs> Don't worry, Sleepy. Don't worry. It happens to the best of us. <laughs> Underscore put underscore you underscore you underscore sleep. Thanks oh, hell it's time yeah. to celebrate. Hell yeah, let's celebrate. Hell yeah. Oh, this guy down here I didn't fly through. This might be the last one, but I'm also missing. I'm missing a uh, honeycomb piece. I underscore put underscore you underscore you underscore sleep. Wasn't expecting that. Yeah, hell yeah. I'm never expecting it. I'm never expecting any of it. Trixie! <laughs> what uh what did I what did I do that's that's elicited that reaction, Trixie? <laughs> Was it when I said it happens to the best of us about Super Saiyan Creamin? No no please go through the oh we're gonna run out of feathers. Yeah, go through. Yeah, no, are you are you freaking kidding me? I ain't go through. There we go. Beautiful. Oh no. Oh hell yeah, Trixie! I'm really glad to hear it. That's fantastic. I mean, that's just that's just a fact of life. We were playing CS:GO. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. How are you? How are you doing? How are you doing at CSGO, Martian? I feel like I feel like you're probably really good at CSGO. You'll be you'll be pleased to know the Beardy Bunch. I'm almost positive it's what we're playing tomorrow, but the Beardy Bunch are gonna be playing Rocket League again tomorrow. Hell yeah, that's awesome. Aw, oh, salute to you too, Sleepy. Yeah, so the boys are gonna be back in town. Rocketing all over this league. Uh, 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 
Oh, there we go. Okay. Um, so, but we're missing. We're missing one. Oh wait, does does he spit something out if I ground pound on him again? The uh, the camel. Oh, there we go. Yep, everybody's gonna be yelling at me for how bad I am at Rocket League again tomorrow. I thought you were about to say you guys were gonna be playing CS:GO. Uh, I don't. I I do I do have CS:GO in the lineup for uh, viewer requested days because Martian requested CSGO. I have I have a distinct feeling that I'm not going to be very good at CSGO. Oh, there we go. That's the last one. Whoa! That's it! I'm leaving this desert to find some peace and quiet! There we go. We got it. Think I'll do great at CSGO? I don't know. I'm not good at shooters. The only one I've ever been my moderately good at was Overwatch. And even that was, was not very impressive. As long as I play it for at least two hours. Okay. Oh, you think I do great at Rocket? Oh. I don't know about that. I think you I think you might be the only one that feels that way, Trixie. <laughs> Dad got so mad at me last time. <laughs> the, the second time we played it, um, not the Beardy Bunch plays, but when I did it for the viewer request day and Dad was playing with me, Dad got so freaking mad. I don't believe that, Trixie. You'll have to come play with us sometime. You'll have to come play some Rocket League. Alright, so we finished. We finished! Mountain, Treasure Trip Code, Clanker's Cavern, Bubble Gloop Swamp, Freezy Z Peak, Gobi's Valley. Now we're going back to Mad Monster Mansion. <laughs> I'm well, I'm well aware, Martian. <laughs> I'm well aware. You're not, you're not telling me anything I don't already know. Except that one game where I did really well for some reason. There was like that one game where I scored a bunch of points, and that was like the entirety of the points I scored for the entire stream. I, I feel like the Beardy Bunch, though, when I play with, with Billy and Dad, we have a certain a certain connection that just we, we usually do really well. We're just connected. <laughs> Sir, get away from me! I think I think our best bet is gonna be to immediately become a pumpkin because I think most of the ones that we didn't get in here were ones that we need to become become a pumpkin for oh uh, you know what one we didn't we didn't do because somebody redeemed uh, I think redeemed the card when we were doing it that stopped me from being able to do it was the the Ouija board one spent so much time on the ceiling it's ridiculous you have zero car control and negative ball that's how i feel that's exactly how i feel i don't have any control over where my car goes like sometimes i just get lucky and i happen to go in the right direction I think it's 12. I think it's 12 that we need for for Click Clock Woods. And if we are, we're in we're in good shape. Because that's the last set of mumbo tokens that we should need. We also should break down all these gates. Uh, but where is the I'm in there already. Over here, okay, here we go. 
a little, a little shed. Okay, here we go. We didn't get this one. This is going to be real close. Boom. At last, the puzzle is solved. Take this thing. I'm leaving this gloomy shed. Oh, goodbye. Goodbye, sentient glass. <laughs> I hope you enjoy <laughs> the next life. <laughs> The sentient living glass that we needed to spell out Banjo Kazooie to set free. We've set it free upon the world. Now, what sorts, what sorts of of catastrophe will it leave in its wake? This is dangerous water. Oh, we got we got those 69 notes. Nice. I don't care about the eggs. Sorry, Chad, I ruined it by collecting more notes. I wonder if I can do this as... I think, for some reason I think I need to be the pumpkin to do this, but I don't remember. Oh no, I guess not. Oh, I... Oh, I need to be the pumpkin to go through there, though. Let me click this, though. Oh no, come on, go in there. Sleepy! How you doing, Sleepy? It's always so good to see a Sleepy. Come on, grab the freaking thing. There we go. Um, I'm going to come back here as the pumpkin to get all the notes. Um, we want to break... We want to break the... What's over there? Oh, just some boots. Well, actually, they could have been potentially helpful. That's fine. We already did it. Uh, we want to go break the windows on the house. Because we need to get the pumpkin up on the second floor. There's a bunch of stuff. Look at that ghosty boy. Look at it. It's very, it's very fitting for this level. Spoopy ghost boy. It's very, very fitting. I don't remember which ones we need. This one we need. We need the pumpkin. We gotta we gotta get flushed down the toilet. I think both windows we need the pumpkin. The bird sounds almost like Togepi. Hmm. I mean, I'm you could be you could be right. I don't like when I'm running? 
or when I do the... I don't hear it, but you're, you're probably correct. I also haven't watched the Pokemon anime in a long time, which is why it's going to be a lot of fun on, on Wednesday when we have our Pokemon anime watch party on the Discord. two more and I think both of them are I think they're both things that we need the pumpkin to get if I'm not mistaken although I don't know about the last honeycomb piece because there's we know where one is oh and it fly oh I'll have to listen I'll have to listen next time okay, this just goes in here we already did this Oh, what, that, I can kind of, yeah, I can kind of hear, I can kind of hear a Togepi. I'm real, I'm real excited to watch some Pokemon, although I'm a little disappointed they rolled out this app on the, on the Switch that's like a Pokemon TV app that has all the, a bunch of different anime related things to watch. And it has seasons one and two, and then it skips to the modern season. It doesn't have the whole series on there. I was kind of hoping it would have the whole series, and then I could rewatch through the whole series. Even aside from the watch party, I could just rewatch through the, the whole series of Pokemon. I wonder if maybe they're going to add other seasons later on. I know there's a bunch on Amazon. I think they're on Amazon Prime. But at least it has the first two seasons, which is the entirety of the of the Kanto, um, like the original series. It was broken into two seasons. Um, I think the second season is primarily like the 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 Poke League. I forget what they they called it when when Ash was competing to become the Pokemon League champion. I think that's most of the of the second season. But the third season was really hyped too, because that was the Orange Islands. I really like the Orange Islands. I don't know how, I don't know how folks feel about the the Orange Islands saga in the Pokemon anime. But when I was a kid, I always really enjoyed them. All right, let's go become a pumpkin. Make sure there's not anything hidden, like a honeycomb hidden. Okay. Because they were real sneaky with that one in Bubble Gloop. We're a little pumpkin! Look how adorable we are! We're an adorable little pumpkin! We're so freaking cute! Look at us! Alright, so. We want to go. go. Oh, you know what? We want to go over here. 
it over here? It may not be over here. Yeah, over there. I'm gonna go in the water, because I think that's the last of the music uh -huh. notes. It does feel like they're planning on adding more stuff to that app. Because they have a whole section for movies, and there's only one movie in there right now. So it feels to me like maybe they are planning to add more, or switch out. Maybe they'll switch out the movies or something. Like, you'll have a certain amount of time to watch this movie, and then they'll switch it out. Alright, so we got that. I think we have to drop down. We have to get up on the roof and then drop down. Which I think there's like a ram on the hedges somewhere that we can use to get up on the up onto the roof. a way to get up. I don't remember where it is. There's a way to get up on these hedges. And then you can run around. Like, I think this might be the section you jump off of. Normally you can't walk on the hedges, but as the pumpkin, it doesn't hurt you. I don't know where it is. There's one section where you're able to get up. in the hedge maze. Oh, I hope it's not over there. Oh shoot, you know what? I think it's over there. And I didn't break the... Imagine how tired you would get. You get real tired real fast. Will you guys come on? Leave me alone. I'm just a little pumpkin. I'm just a little pumpkin trying to live my life. I'm just trying to find a way onto the roof. Imagine if there were if there were sentient pumpkins like this. And on, on Thanksgiving when you want to make your pumpkin pie, the first thing you'd have to do is catch the runaway pumpkin. I think it's through... No, that goes over to there, I think. I think it goes over to the church. 
Unless that's a whole other section. Ugh, is it? Damn. Oh yeah, no, this comes over here, so we don't need... We don't need to break that. I don't remember where it is that we can hop up. There's somewhere that we can hop up on the... Oh, we could have come... Oh, here it is! I knew it. Oh. <laughs> but I mean, technically, you don't you don't have legs. Little pumpkins don't have legs, so it'd be like... Um, would it, would it be booty day every day? <laughs> you just work at that booty? <laughs> that little, that little pumpkin booty? <laughs> work it, little pumpkin. Flush me. Happy landings, little one. <laughs> Some serious junk in the trunk. <laughs> Wait, that's not the last one. Oh, no, no. The other one's the last one. Okay. No, that's fine. The other one's the last one. But there's no... Oh, I don't know where the last... The last honeycomb piece is in this area. This is it. Oh, captions won't turn off. Um, will I try? Is anybody else having that issue? I hope not. I would try refreshing Trixie and see if it'll let you turn them off. I'm sorry about that. They're supposed to be designed so you can you can turn them on and off. Let me know if they won't turn off, because I can I can turn them off on my end for the rest of the stream. Hey, Goose Brigader, how you doing, my friend? Welcome on in. How are you? Long time no see. How have you been? I don't know where the last freaking honeycomb went. Am I, are we still missing one? Maybe I grabbed it and I don't remember. No, I'm missing one. Mm, it could be in one of the buildings that we haven't been in in a while. Ugh, I don't think we want to be a pumpkin, though. Let's get turned back. Actually, I have the walkthrough already pulled up. Let me just look. So we're not wandering around for, like, the next 45 minutes. If it's somewhere really obscure. Mad Monster Mansion! Extra honeycomb pieces. First one's under the floor. In the church. Okay. Yeah, I'm glad I looked it up. Okay, so we've got to get turned back. I'm doing fantastic. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for asking. You're getting Mario Odyssey tomorrow. Oh, you're going to have such a good time. Mario Odyssey is such a good game. Mario Odyssey is a fantastic title. You're going to have such an amazing time. Turn me back. I want to be a bear and a bird. Thank you. Goodbye. We're gonna stream it on Wednesday. Hell yeah! I'll definitely try to pop on by and, and see some. Cause I I could always go for some Mario Odyssey action. I haven't played Odyssey in a couple years. You're off now. Oh, hell yeah. I'm sorry, Trixie. I don't know what happened. 
Uh, I think we gotta... No, other way around. We gotta restart. And then run like the crazy bird bear that we are! Uh oh, uh oh, I don't know if we're gonna make it. Oh, hell yeah, with one second to spare! That's what I call, that's what I call good running ability. We gotta get up into the rafters. So I think there's a flight pad in here somewhere. Giving Roadrunner a run for, oh hell yeah. Yeah, who who needs Roadrunner when you've got Banjo Kazooie? That's all you need in your life. Oh, wait, I thought there was a oh, there's some flight pad. Okay. I knew there was one up here somewhere. There it is. I think we're good on mumbo tokens, so I'm gonna grab this first. There we go. All the all the switches up here. Crap. So we didn't miss this too. Boom. Alright. Now we're done here. We got a new capture card, which we'll get here Tuesday, so you can stream games on your Switch. Oh, hell yeah. That's what it's all about, Goose. I love playing console games. Well, I love playing console games in general. Once in a while we do PC games, but console games are kind of where it's at for me. Where is the exit? There it is. I missed notes on the bat. Wait, did I miss notes in there? Oh shit, I thought I had all the notes. Oops. Thank you so much for that. Lu Lucario R. Lucario R? Thank you so much. Oh, I did miss notes. Thank you. Oh shit. Thank you. I thought we were down on notes. I wasn't even looking for notes. I really appreciate that. We're missing a bunch of notes. Oh shit. Okay. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. I don't know why I thought I thought I was done with notes. your day treating you? How you feeling after the 12 hour stream yesterday? You're good. It's been a lazy day. I feel fine. Woke up and did some chores all day. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. I'm really glad to hear it. I'm glad that there was no lasting effect from the, the big stream. Hey, get out of here. Get out of here, you big ghost. 
Me here, we're, we're official Ghostbusters now, Lily and I. Even if we, if we, even if we died to more ghosts than we actually discovered in Phasmophobia yesterday. Ooh, so where am I missing? I'm missing a bunch of notes still. effect the stream had was making you tired i didn't get drunk beyond beyond tipsy yeah i've the only time i've ever seen you get like really drunk was was during drunk born other than that it doesn't seem to have a ton of effect on you in the well area in the in the water i i did get all of them as far as I know, I got all of them from around the outside, and I grabbed the ones on the inside as the pumpkin. So that section, I think I did get all of the... All of the, uh... I don't know if there... Are there any up in the rafters? I don't think there are. I'm gonna check just to be on the safe side. But yeah, I think, Lucario, I think I did get all of them in the well area. I'm trying to think if there's anywhere we didn't go. I don't know if we ever went... Hmm... Wait, what's back here? Anything? Ooh. Oh, your medicine just went down the wrong pipe. I hope you're okay, Night Owl. I'm really sorry to hear that. We'll double check the... Let me check up here. I don't think there's any up here. It's been a while since I played this, though, so I could be wrong. Let's check. We'll check the well area just to be on the safe side. But I'm pretty sure I got everything from the well area. Oh, this is not the well area. Right now, you go through. You go through over here to get to the well area. And here, and over here, and down here. And we're just in over here. Yeah, so let's see, well area. I grab those. I grab those over there. And I'm pretty sure we got everything in the well. Uh oh, what's the matter, Andrew? Yeah, we got everything in here. So the well is clear. You waifu hunt way too hard. What? Whatever do you mean, Andrew? <laughs> who? Who are you? What waifu are you on the prowl for? <laughs> do tell. I feel that we need we need some some deets on your waifu hunt. <laughs> over here maybe it's is there another Genshin Impact is pulling you back in with verified cuties I've never played Genshin Impact I've, I've never even really looked at like I, from what I, I think I've seen of Genshin Impact it looks like very Breath of the Wild inspired like it has a very similar gameplay style to Breath of the Wild but I've never touched Genshin. But I've also heard that Genshin is a huge microtransaction vacuum. That once you fall in, there's no escaping. Oh, 
You have free units and rewards that let you summon. The question is, though, how long do the free rewards last before it's a matter of, well, if I really want to get this character that I want, I'm going to have to spend money. Because that's how they usually get you. Like, they'll, they'll give you a little bit in the beginning to just kind of coax you into the game. And then once they've got their hooks in you, they, uh, they start ramping up. Oh, no! I was almost dead. <laughs> uh, is there anything in that chest? I wasn't able to open that chest last time I was in there. I think so. I went into the well. I went down the toilet. I went into the the spout that goes down into the um. That goes down to where the jiggy is at the bottom, in the little, in the ring gutter. Can we open this? Doesn't seem like it. Yeah, we went in all those places. It's probably there's probably some somewhere really obvious that I just missed them. So let me just retrace my steps. It's probably somewhere really obvious that I just somehow overlooked them. This really feels like it should be openable. It's really bothering me that I can't open it. You got sucked into Dragalia Gotcha. I'm glad I escaped. Yeah, those those kind of... Oh, and Furry Lolitas, uh, a chaos pack for you. Hell yeah, Furry Lolitas. Let me get that pack over your way. Those uh, those sorts of games are, are really dangerous for your wallet once you get sucked in. There you go, Furry Lolitas. I'm, uh, I'm not familiar with Dragalia. Oh wait, you know what? I don't I don't think I ever went in here. But I bet this is where they are. There they are. I never came in here. Found them. Oh, there better be one more in here. Oh no, there better be one more. There we go. Oh. Oh, there we go. We did it, Lucario. I forgot about that there was a room on the other side too. I'm glad you mentioned something, because I legit thought we had all of them. I don't know why I thought we got the little message that we had them all. So thank you so much for pointing out that we did it. Now we're going to Rusty Bucket Bay! Which is my favorite level in the game. Uh, oh, how do I get the... How do I get the one in the eye? Oh, I think I need the flying pad. Which I think I need to do some stuff over here. Can't forget about the ones in, in the lair. It's by Nintendo and Mobile. Thankfully, my free summons were pretty lucky. Ooh. I didn't... Okay, here we go. So we're going to hit the switch. And then we're going to run like crazy people. No! I missed the shoot. There we go. I think I fucked up, though. I think I took too long to grab the shoes. Oh, I took too long. I took too long to grab the shoes.
think there's... So I think there's a thing out here. We need this for, and then we're gonna need it again. So this one's up here. Alright, so this one. Uh, there we go. Oh, got it. Play free to play on that, and it's quite fun. I just come back every other month or so. Oh, for uh, Dragalia Lost. I don't know. I've never gotten crazy into any any mobile games. Other than like I played Pokemon Go, like a fiend when it first came out. And I've been thinking about getting back into Pokemon Go as like an excuse to get out and make it part of like a walking routine. So do I do the beak? First into your eye? Yes. There we go. Again, this makes zero sense. <laughs> how is this how is this section of the map underwater but not overflowing out into the other part of the map? I don't remember what's over here. Uh, what is this? This raises the water. We don't want to raise the water right now because we want to go to Rusty Bucket Bay. Love the music here. I'm gonna cr I'm cranking the music in this area because I freaking love Rusty Bucket Bay music. I missed it. No! Although I don't... I don't know that I need any more Mumbo tokens. Is there really like... Oh, can I make it come out more? No. Where did I get that one? That's fine. I don't think I need any more Mumbo tokens. We gotta get that guy. There's notes over there. I think we barely even touched this level the last time we played. Let's see, what have we collected here? Oh, well we've already got both honeycombs, that's good. Oh, that one's breakable. Oh, 
Oh, oh, buddy. Unless maybe there was... Maybe I went in there already. And there was a honeycomb in there. Honeycomb piece. No! Oh. This is the worst thing that could have happened. Don't worry, don't worry, little dolphin. I'll, um, actually, can I? I think I can go inside here, and that's how I freed him. Trixie, we will be here. Thank you so much for hanging out. I really appreciate it, Trixie. Thanks, guys. I found this earlier. It's yours. You pooped out a jigsaw piece. Hey, Melgitos! How you doing, my friend? How are you, Melgitos? It's always so good to see you. box. <laughs> Phoenix the Flame, thank you so much for the raid. Welcome on in, raiders. How's everybody doing this fine, fine Sunday evening? Phoenix, how are you? Thank you so much for the raid. I really appreciate it. How is your stream? How did everything go? Well, I think I may have been over here already. Hell yeah! Hell yeah! That's what we like to hear, Phoenix. It's so good to see you, too. Good, tired, but good. Hell yeah! Well, hopefully, hopefully you'll be able to relax and unwind for the rest of your evening. Well, if it is, if it is evening where you are. 
Panda Play Playze. How you doing, my friend? Welcome on in. So good to have you here. So good to have everybody here. Mm, oh, chili, Panda huh? Playze, thank you so much for that follow. I really appreciate it. I very much appreciate that, so thank you so much. I think we came in here already. It's almost 11. Oh, okay. Oh, so you're you're an hour behind me. You're an hour behind me because it's almost midnight for me. Hell yeah. Well, hopefully you'll get to you'll get to spend the the end of your evening relaxing and unwinding stuff. Yeah, we did this already. Ooh, nearly 5 a.m. I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think that where that would put you time zone wise, but I'm I'm drawing a blank. That's that's not a time zone I'm familiar with. I'm sorry. But that's that's awesome that either a you're taking time out of your 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 late evening if you're still up or your early morning to hang out with some wonderful streamers here on Twitch like like Phoenix and myself. Oh, the UK, okay. We don't have... I don't think we have too many viewers from the UK. I'm trying to think if we have anyone from the UK. We have we have a bunch of viewers from Australia, um, which I think is because I usually stream later in the evening, and it's, it's earlier hours in Australia. Also, um, my co-host on the podcast that I'm a part of is, is Australian. So I, we bring in a lot of... Oh, this is the different... This is the other one. I think this one's on a time limit. It is. Crap. Go hurry. Go hurry. Now we're gonna jump. Oh, look at that. Perfect. Uh, yeah, we have a, a podcast. There's actually a link down in the in the about me that'll take it to the um, the Spotify page. Um, it's called The Beardy Bunch Podcast. It's uh, a podcast with three bearded dudes who talk about nerdy things and pop culture and basically anything else. It's really started to become kind of a, an improv comedy hour for us. Um, but it's myself, Billy Rids, Mr. Mobbles, Mr. Billy Rids, and ATM Zero, who we also know as Dad, um, are all part of the, the podcast. It's, uh, it's a lot of <laughs> Pray Lolitas! <laughs> Why would you do that? <laughs> Why would you do that, Pray Lolitas? <laughs> I mean, <laughs> that's what it's there for, but oh god! <laughs> Let's just have it a peaceful time playing, playing Banjo Kazooie. <laughs> oh no, is there more? Is it, is it not just 312? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that that's a really I may have to I may have to go into that one and adjust the volume on it cuz I think that may be the first time anyone's played it and it's really loud. So I'm sorry for anyone that is listening on headphones. <laughs> that one's really loud. So I may I may adjust the volume on that one. <laughs> Not that it's a bad thing that it uh it, it it's obviously startling cuz that's the point of it, but I feel bad for anyone that's that's listening, and they have headphones on. I'm, I'm so sorry, Night Owl. <laughs> we, we have a number of those, but I think that's, that's the one that really takes the cake for being as loud as physically possible. <laughs> oh, thank you so much, Phoenix. I'm sure, I'm sure my face when it happened was priceless. Oh. Lily! Yeah! Lily, what's going on? How are you, Lily? 
works at 111? Oh, that's kind of there. That's kind of bullshit. <laughs> the Mario bounce thing. I'm so glad my neighbor recently moved out. Oh no, Night Owl, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Lily! How are you, Lily? Did you get a did you get a good night's well, a good day's rest? Cause I think you're back to work today, aren't you? Oh, hell yeah. Hopefully hopefully work is going easy on you so far. Hopefully it's gonna be a slow night for you. I hope so for your sake. But it's always so good to see you, Lily. Cool. This is your work, Panda. Um, what what do you do? In what in what aspect is it your work? What uh what do you do? If if that's okay for me to ask. Oh, you got school! Hell yeah! Hell yeah! What uh what are you going to school for? If you're if you're okay sharing. Oh, school! Hell yeah! That's awesome. That's really awesome. Oh, okay, okay. Nothing wrong with that. Uh, a pack of stream loot from Martian! Martian legend, God King! Who still comes up as the Martian Young in... On, uh... Oh, maybe it finally changed. No, it still comes up as the Martian Young on, on Stream Loot. So I guess when, when folks change their names on Twitch, it doesn't change on Stream Loot. Uh, secondary, uh, it would still be, I, I think it would still be considered secondary school. Is that years 9 through 12 for you? Because that's what we consider secondary school. Yeah, it's uh, we, it it's called high school, but also it's called secondary school. I actually, um, I'm I'm old, <laughs> I'm I'm long out of out of high school. But I went to I actually went to school and got a, a teaching degree, um, which I've never actually used. But when I went to school, I went for secondary education, which is essentially high school. Seven to oh okay, so we consider seventh and eighth to be middle school. Uh, I think it's sixth, seventh, and eighth is considered middle school, and then nine through twelve is considered secondary or high school. How do I get up on? Oh, I gotta use this. Maybe. Oh wait, no. I know what I need to do. I know what I need to do. Where's the... I don't actually need to open this because we already beat Boss Box last time we played this game. Because you got a fortune cookie saying a cheerful letter or message is on its way to you and my dad just told me oh no sleepy i'm so sorry i'm so sorry to hear that sleepy that's awful i'm really sorry to hear that my friend oh see six six to eight is considered middle school when i where i went to school But that just might have been the way the schools were set up. So... I, th I think there's a couple areas in the ship, but we're gonna have to eventually go into the Nightmare Gauntlet. I'm not looking forward to the Nightmare Gauntlet, but I think we can break some of these windows. Uh, we can go in there. Where does this go? 
Is this, this goes down to the Nightmare Gauntlet, doesn't it? Oh no. I don't have any. Sir, sir, I don't have. Oh, guys, guys, listen, I don't have any invincibility feathers. I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to poop eggs on you, okay? Here, take my egg. Take my egg. Alright, never mind, you're over there. Did anyone else go to a K through 12? Oh, that's really interesting, Night Owl. Um, no, I I think there is one school in our area that's like a privately owned school that does K through 12, and it's like not necessarily in one building, but it's all like on one campus. That's really interesting, though. It's got a. It, it must be nice to be in the in the same building for all twelve years too. You get you can get real comfortable. You go to school, but when I'm not in school, I'm gaming. Hell yeah! Have you have you? Do you stream Panda? That's awesome if you do. I'll uh, I'll definitely throw a follow back your way after I wrap up today. Oh, it gets a bit lonely. Oh no. Uh, you are, you're more than welcome if you have Discord, Panda. Um, we have a section in the Discord where you can shout yourself out and let folks know when you're going live. So that if you go live and you shout yourself out, maybe some folks will hop on over and hang out. Uh, I mean, once I fall, if I see you go live, I'll definitely be hopping on over. We're, we're real big on helping to support one another in this community. Um, honestly, that's how, that's how most of us have, have made it to where we are. Uh, but if you do exclamation point Discord in the chat, it'll give you the the link to join the Discord. Um, and we do have the, uh, I think it's streamer shout out or shout yourself out or something along those lines. But you're more than welcome to post some ads. And if you have your your Discord linked up with your, your Twitch account, I could actually set you as a streamer so it'll auto shout you out anytime you go live. Yeah, no problem. That's what we're, honestly, that's what we're all about here. We're all about supporting one another. A good majority of the folks in this community are also streamers. So we're real big on, on supporting one another and helping each other reach whatever goals we have set for one another. That's what we're all about. It's comfortable, but since the town had a population of 1,800, it's almost too small with little opportunities. Oh, that stinks, Night Owl. I'm so sorry to hear that. That stinks. I, I can't even imagine being in the same school because between like elementary school, middle school, and high school, it all felt so significantly different going to different schools that I can't even picture being in the same building for all those years. Ooh, how so, Panda? What, uh, what makes schools in the UK weird? Oh, it's, it's just everything in general? The students, the teachers. I mean, that's that's most of... That's most of what, uh, what school's all about. They don't, ha they don't have lockers. Ooh. That's interesting. So what do you, what do you do with your stuff during the day? Or do you just have to carry it on you at all times? Oh, yeah, carry it. Oh, that kind of stinks. I'm sorry. Oh, fuck. Stupid bear, you'll have to learn that red hot ovens tend to burn. Sh shut up, Grunty. I didn't learn my lesson, Grunty. I jumped right into the oven. How does that make you feel? Ooh, we almost got. We almost got all the notes. Coat, bag, books, every oh that stinks. that really stinks. They have to just carry it all around with you. Do you have to move around a lot? Like do you have to go is every class for you in a different room? Or do you get to stay put in pretty sure it's just eggs in the fridge. Do you get to stay put in are all your classes in the same room? Oh, 
So what are we? Furry Lolita's oh, wants a nice little shiny nice little right now. A nice little shiny. Uh, furry Lolita's for not. We're not playing Sea of Thieves. <laughs> usually, usually the shanty is playing music in Sea of Thieves. <laughs> uh, I don't know if I have any more oatmeal pirate songs. Uh, yo ho, yo ho, we are the oatmeal pirates. <laughs> That's my go-to whenever people need a shanty. Because <laughs> if uh, for any of the new folks here, when we play Sea of Thieves, we're the Oatmeal Pirates. Hmm. <laughs> oh, I think we have to go... I don't think I have a choice. I think I gotta go down to the shit show area now. How many things are we missing? Six. We're missing four. That seems like a lot. Any more windows? Thankfully you're not school age anymore, so you don't have to worry about all that. Yeah, I was I was not a fan. I was not a fan of of school. I don't know about every, anybody else. I know it's usually one or the other. Either you loved high school, or not necessarily high school, but just school in general, and you would do anything to go back, or you completely hated it, and I was of the, of the latter. I need 11 more notes. I don't like that it's an uneven number. But I guess that doesn't necessarily mean anything. Enjoy being a teen while it lasts. I know it sucks, but stuff gets harder. Yeah, that is true. That is true. Once you're out and you're working and you've got responsibility and you got to make money, and it, it's definitely not. It's definitely not a, a ton of fun. But I mean, you you make fun. You make fun wherever you can, like playing games and doing the things that you enjoy. Dark-minded Sith. Oh, this is my all-time favorite game, Dark-minded Sith. I'm starting to get into the later parts of the game that I didn't play as as much when I was a kid, so my memory's a little bit foggier on, say, this this world and Click Clock Woods is gonna be a little bit rougher. But um, this is my all-time favorite game from my childhood. Aha! Hi, how you doing? Get out of here. This year you've got your religious studies exam and PE exams. Ooh. Are you uh is that is that public schooling over there, Panda? Or is that do you go to a private school? Is that why you have to take religious studies? Cause I went to a public school in the US and we didn't have to take any kinds of religious studies. Right, so I th one of them's the Jinjos. One of them's down in the propellers that we have to stop. And I don't know. Is there one in the room with the? Uh... All right, we're gonna go. As much as I don't want to do it, we're going down here. Gotta do it. This is the the most difficult room in the game, in my opinion. Alright, okay, so there's some of the notes that we need. Um tried doing this last time and it just didn't go well. I don't know which way I want to go first. Maybe to the right. I'd say I think schools could benefit greatly from a religious studies course as long as it's taught purely from a neutral scholar. I agree. I 100% agree. Like a, like a history kind of situation. I 100% I agree with that. 
because I think it would it would help you it would help folks understand more where different religions come from and their sorts of mindsets. Whereas usually you're you're educated in whatever whatever religion um, you or your family are a part of, so you don't usually get a ton of information on on other religions. I know in public school, at least the public school that I went to in the U.S., they they stayed as far as physically possible away from religious studies. Um, but when I went to college, it was a, it was a Catholic college, so we had to take a, a a religious course. But it was, of course, it was a, a Catholic religious course, so it was only only covered a single religion. there no but how do we stop the oh fuck there is no there's a time limit there's a freaking time limit It's fine. We got it. It's fine. <laughs> we got it. It's fine. We got the... That's all that matters is that we got it. <laughs> I knew that was going to happen. Uh, how, how do I get under there? There we go. I think the... Is the last Jinjo down here? There he is. This poor Jinjo is trapped under this polluted water. I'll save you. Oh, look at that. Look at that pepperoni cross. Look at that pepperoni cross. That's what I'm talking about. We've got a, we've got a little bit of a hot dog theme here in the channel. Because um, I, I started off calling my subs my chili dogs. And now we have, like, exclusively hot dog related emotes. Well, not exclusively, but... A good majority of our emotes are hot dog related. Yeah, luckily this is the Xbox version. That would have been a shit show if that if this was the original version. Luckily we're playing we're playing the Xbox version, which took out the the note record. Which was a little bit of an annoyance. How do I get to that other room? Because there's another room in there. And that's where you turn off the fans. To grab those notes, I can't go up that way. Somewhere in the water to get in there. No. There's someone in the water. Mmm, chilly, huh? Dark minded Sith, thank you so much for that follow. I really appreciate it. I hope you're you're enjoying your stay here. I hope you're reminiscing with some banjo kazooie action. It's so good to have you here. I'm I'm drawing a blank on this last one. I know there's a way in there. What is it? 
miss it. I don't think there's any way in. Because we went in the way to let the... To let the dolphin free. But that didn't take us to that room. Uh, we're missing... Uh, we're missing one Jiggy, and then the last of the notes, I can see them. They're in the- they're in the room with the propellers. I just can't get through the propellers, and then there's some in the- in the windowed off room, which is where I also think the last Jiggy is. So, I, the, I think that's the- the last area to go to. I just don't remember how to get in there. Oh, and how are we looking at- oh, we have all the honeycomb pieces. Yeah, so we literally just need eight more notes and then the last Jiggy. Which I'm almost positive is... I don't think there's a way in through here. I'm gonna double check. So there's... Oh, that's, that's the last Jiggy over there. Uh, it's in a smoke exhaust. Okay. Okay, because that's literally... But I'm pretty sure we need to get in over there. Because um, that's where the last notes are, and I think there's a switch in there. Oh, yeah, I do. I see a ladder. There's a ladder that comes down. Okay, so it's one of the smoke exhausts. Man, this was a mistake. That's okay, I made it. <laughs> Alright, let's check the smoke exhausts. And then we'll be moving on to Click Clock Woods is the level I have the least the least knowledge of. Because that was like the one level that I almost never made it to when I would play this game as a kid. But I don't think it's this one, I think it's the one up here. Ooh, is that your is that your favorite level in the game? Seth? Um, I I actually really like this level and I really like Mad Monster Mansion. Even if I don't remember this level that well, I remember having oh, uh -oh. I remember having really fond memories of this level when I was a kid because I remember getting here and like being blown away. Because games were considerably more difficult back then. It would take. Ooh, how do we get in there? It's not here. I bet it's one of... I bet it's one of the, uh, the pipe... Maybe the pipe enemies? Or the ones that aren't enemies that you can climb into? So, like, maybe this guy over here? Oh, wait, he's alive. Do I have any? Oh, you can't... I've never noticed you can't kill them with invisibility. I don't know that I've ever tried to kill one of them. Alright, so maybe it's this? Mm. No, it's not here. And I would imagine, since this is the way down, if, like, spatially speaking, not that, 
things being spatially lined out, lined up, necessarily matters in this game. But I would think it would be over this way. Because we go down through here. This is the door. We go down through here, and then we go over this way. And it's like over this way, under here. window. I don't think it's this window. But I'm going to check anyway, just to be on the safe side. You know, this is the navigation room. He's alive. This goes to the kitchen, I believe. I believe this goes to the kitchen. Yep. One. Yep, this goes to the bedroom. Or the, I think that might be the captain's quarters. I don't remember how to get in there. I don't remember ever having this much trouble getting in there. Oh no, Lily, I'm so sorry. I mean, it is, it is only a 50% chance with Great Balls. Is there anything up here? Oh, wait, what's this? No, this is nothing. Hmm. It feels like it's supposed to be one of these. There's not, like, a door. No. It really feels like it's supposed to be one of these. is very serious about her Pokemon. She's on that road to becoming the Pokemon Master. How do I get in there? <laughs> I'm about to I'm about to look it up. <laughs> I don't I don't remember ever having trouble getting in there before. Oh no, Lily! <laughs> You're an angry kitty! <laughs> uh, hmm. Alright, I'm looking it up. <laughs> Instead of just wandering around. Alright, here we go. Uh, I have the guide up already. Let me just switch to... Rusty Bucket Bay! They have they have the propeller one. Oh, they have this as number one. You might as well get the hardest two jiggies out of the way for it. Yeah, thank, thanks, IGN. Head back to the ship and enter the pipe that does. Head back to the ship and enter the pipe that does not eat you. There's a lot of pipes that don't try to eat me, IGN. It's not this. So it isn't a pipe. All right. So it isn't a pipe. We were we were not mistaken. It isn't a pipe. I love how they just say, go back to the ship and go in the pipe that doesn't try to eat you. Like, there's only one of them. That one tries to eat me. Oh, you're right. You're right, Sith. There's one in the back. There's one all the way in the back. You're right. I forgot all about it. There is one back here. As soon as you said it, I realized. I remembered. This is the one. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> poor, poor actual kitty. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Night Owl. We're we're pro we're pro kitties here. All right, so this will turn off the propellers. <laughs> the stern of the ship. Yeah, as soon as you as soon as you said it, it clicked in the place that there were there were two of the the smokestacks on the back. Woo! 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 
En presión bajo el Mrs. Beef Mail Demons. I love how I love how the two the 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 voice clip and the blurp blended together. <laughs> oh yeah, hotline. We we said we said angry angry kitty and night owls uh, kitty stormed out of the room. No 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 no! Oh my god! This fucking shit show. This guy, no no! Oh, I'm gonna have to do that again, aren't I? <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna have to do that again. I mean, it's not that big of a deal. Oh, you got the 1K Bits badge! Neon Medusa, thank you so much. I really appreciate all the support. Sir? Oh, that's right, I forgot the... I forgot the sir emote is a, is a bit emote. So now you've got the sir? Sir? <laughs> emote. I'm gonna make sure the button's pushed. Before we go down there. Dusty! I say, I say, sir, what? <laughs> Get away from me. Uh, what are some of my other favorite games? Uh, I'm a big fan of Dark Souls. I play a lot of Souls games. Um, I've always been a big fan of Nintendo games in general. Uh, both modern and older Nintendo games. We're also playing uh, Donkey Kong 64 for our... We do a throwback day every Tuesday. So we've also been playing some Donkey Kong 64. We we started playing this for a portion of... I did a 12-hour stream last weekend to celebrate hitting 400 followers. Uh, and we played about, I think, five hours of this last weekend. And we didn't quite finish it. So I wanted to come back and play some more. I'm trying to think what else has been really... Ooh, this past year. So a couple of games from this past year that I really enjoyed were... Um, Hollow Knight is one of my new favorites. Uh, I'm going to play 2E. I think I'm going to play 2E for my birthday. So I think I might play 2E for my birthday in November. I'm not going to play it right away. I like to I like to spread things out and kind of alternate what we play. But I think I'm going to play 2E for my birthday in November. I, I really enjoy 2E. I'm almost on the fence, which I, the, I always go back and forth between these two games. I have not played Psychonauts yet. I have... I have Psychonauts on um, the Xbox because it's one of the free games, and I know the new one just came out. It's one of the oh fuck! It's one of the free games on the the Xbox Live Arcade or Game Pass, whatever. So I have plans on playing Psychonauts for the first time soon. Uh, Nia Medusa, thank you so much for those five Corgo biddies and Vanessa. Thank you so much for that follow. I really appreciate that, Vanessa. I hope you're enjoying your time here with us. I really appreciate you being here. All right, so we finished. We finished uh, Rusty Bucket Bay. I think we we did have everything, right? Oh, I love this. This is. I I bounce back and forth between whether this is my favorite banjo game, or if Two is my favorite. They're honestly they're my my top two favorite games of all time. I like, I honestly like both of them. It's really hard Empress for me to pick underscore one. underscore Lily redeemed the free oh, stream loot pack. pack. Here you go, Lily. You got a pack incoming. There you go, Lily. I, I go back and forth. Right now, I think I, I lean more toward this game just because it's a little tighter and more, like, cohesive. Like, you can just sit down and play through the whole thing where 2 usually takes a while. Psychonauts 2 just came out. Yeah, I just saw, and it's also free with the the Xbox Game Pass or the Microsoft Game Pass, whatever it's called. So I might I might dig into some Psychonauts 1. I want to play the first one before I do, jump into the second one. So I might play some of the first Psychonauts um, very soon. That's one game I want to start in September. I also want to start playing Sekiro cuz Sekiro is the only FromSoft uh, Souls S game that I have not beaten, so I plan on playing some Sekiro probably within the next couple weeks. Oh, I definitely. So I think I don't remember if I installed it yet on here. Um, I know I added it to the games to play on the Xbox, so I'm gonna install it very soon, and it's gonna be one 
that I'm gonna play sometime very soon. I try not to have too many games going at once, so I want to wrap this up. We're also doing, we've been playing some Subnautica recently. We actually haven't played Subnautica in a little bit. I think, I think Sleepy's upset, because <laughs> Sleepy's really, a really big fan of Subnautica. Um, so I do want to play some more Subnautica soon. And we've been playing Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth, which I've been really loving. So I want to try and polish off maybe one more game before I start another new one. But I definitely am going to play some some Psychonauts and... Ooh, Empress one. underscore Lily redeemed the free stream loot pack. There you go, Lily. Lily, have you, been, have you been sitting on these or did you just happen to get really lucky and you got another one? There you go, Lily. You got a pack on its way. Oh, you're using the sleepy strats. Uh, I don't hotline. Do you have do you have Xbox Game Pass? Because it is free with Xbox Game Pass. I saw it in the list that it was newly added on there. That it's that it's free. Oh, I'm sorry. I mean, if it's it's probably it's probably cheaper to get a month of of Xbox Game Pass than it is to buy the game. Ahoy! Ahoy there, Lily! Ahoy! Because I forget what Game Pass is like 17 bucks a month and there's a bunch of free games. So honestly, if you wanted to play it and you wanted to just get Game Pass for a month to play it. Ahoy there, Lily! Well, I got enough to open the next door. Honestly, I think we could. I think we could finish the game right now. Maybe? Well, not that I'm going to, but I think technically we could. There might be... I think there's another note door past here that's like 870 or something. I don't want to do that yet, though. Because I want to I wanna try and 100% the game. Oh, this this game is by the by the makers of well, it's by the same the same company that made Conquer's Bad Fur Day. I also really want to play Conquer's Bad Fur Day on the channel at some point because I haven't played that in a very long time. All the old Rareware games from the from the N64 area are up there with some of my all time favorite games. Click Clock Woods! We're almost there! We're almost there, guys. We only got Click Clock Woods and then, uh, the final, the final battle. We gotta swim all the way back. Well, swim part way back. I still, this still makes zero sense to me. You go through this door and it's like, oh, you're not underwater anymore. <laughs> Click Clock Woods is probably going to be the one that's going to take me a little bit because I don't have a ton of... I don't remember ever getting to Click Clock Woods when I was really young when I first played this. I remember I'd always get to Rusty Bucket Bay and then I would get stuck. Uh. That was the last game you got for the, the Conquerors? I didn't play, so I don't have as fond childhood memories of Conquerors because I didn't play Conquerors until the Rare Replay Collection came out. Um, I was really young when Conquerors came out, and I it was an M-rated game, so I absolutely didn't have that as a kid. Because I think I was in maybe like second grade when that came out, first or second grade. Clock Woods! Alright, it's the last level. <laughs> yeah, I didn't I didn't play it as a kid. <laughs> 
I played it as an adult, and I still enjoyed it. I still really enjoyed it. I got I, I got frustrated with the controls, which is always the case with going back to the N64 era games. Uh, like, I've even had moments with this game where I'm like, Oh, God, please just do what I want you to do. <laughs> Hell yeah, nothing wrong with that, Night Owl. Sometimes it's worth the wait. Sometimes it's worth the wait to play a really good game like that. I don't remember what else. I'm still missing... Two jiggies in the lair, and I don't remember what they are. I think there's one that we get through through Click Clock Wood by hitting the switch in there, but I don't remember what the last one is. You know what? I think there's one. Okay, well, I'll worry about it later. But I think there's one when you hit the switch in Mad Monster Mansion. I think that no, the Mad Monster Mansion one appears in the eye. I don't remember. I never minded the. Oh, well, I haven't. I haven't touched an N64 controller, and probably. Probably about 15 years, so um, I honestly don't don't remember 100% how uncomfortable it was to use. But I don't remember ever ever disliking the controller. I will say I went back to, and Lily can attest for this. I went back to Mario 64 when the when the the 3D uh, All Star Collection came out, and I just I can't do it. I can't. It's the con the controls and the camera and everything it was like it was like fighting against the game which i have i have incredible childhood memories with uh mario 64 i just i can't do it again <laughs> Oh, is yeah, I was very angry. <laughs> well, that's why we played Mario. So we did the the 200 follower rageathon. When we hit 200 followers, I did a 12 hour rageathon, where I exclusively played games that that made me angry, and Mario 64 was among them. I will say I freaking love I love the music in um, Quick Lock Woods. I think I need to be the bee. It's such a it's such a jaunty little tune. I mean, well, how can you not how can you not be happy listening to this music? Trixie, welcome back! How you doing, Trixie? I I'm I'm half tempted. I've watched the uh, the Peanut Butter Gamer videos of, of Chaos Edition of Mario 64, and it looks like it would be right up my alley. Because we did, so we did a 12-hour stream two weeks ago. Is it two weeks now? Two weeks yesterday, or was it a week yesterday? Um, for our celebration for having hit 400 followers. And I found this, this mod for the... The really old Sonic games, like the old school Sonic games, where you were essentially playing all four Sonic games at once, um, because every time you collected a ring, it switched games, and it was an absolute nightmare. But that's the kind of chaos that that I really enjoy. <laughs> the funny thing is, everybody wants to play it now, Lily. I've had uh, Andrew messaged me. Uh, Peyton messaged me, and uh, the True Salt King all messaged me to find out where they could get it so they could play it on their stream. And I think Peyton's planning on playing it for... Oh no! Fuck. For his uh, his 300 follower stream. 
It was oh, it was hilarious. All uh, we didn't finish it. I did uh, I did make a save state of where we left off. So maybe one of these days I'll pull it back out again, and we'll we'll see if we could actually beat any of the games or all of the games. But it's it's one of those games I definitely couldn't do a full stream on, because even for me, like my eyes were starting to go funny <laughs> after watching like the screen flashing and the games changing. It was it was really wild. I'll definitely have to dig it up again sometime. Definitely Super Mario 64 Chaos Edition. I would love, I'd love to try. I may look into that one because it it looks it looks so mind-bendingly nightmarish that it would be right up my alley. I, I think it would be worth it to stream just to have my reactions to everything that would happen. No! Are you kidding me? No! <laughs> I can't believe we were all the way up at the top and I fell down. Oh. I missed the platform. We were so close. Oh, no worries, Jinto. At least at least now we can listen we can listen to this jaunty jingle some more. Cause I love this music in this area. I wish the uh, maybe there is. Maybe there's like a playlist of it on Spotify, but I wish the the banjo kazooie mu music were more readily available to just like listen to and jam out to. Cause it's so freaking good. Jintalin wants you to play oh. blindfolded for five minutes. Oh, okay. Okay, this is gonna go real well. <laughs> there you go, Jinto. This is for you. We're gonna do some really tight navigating and platforming blindfolded. Alright, so I gotta go. Oh my god, did, did I do it? Wait, if I did it. Somebody tell me if I did it so that in four minutes when I take the blindfold off, I'll know. I know I'm not going to do it twice, yeah. But I feel like I may have actually done the first one. I have no idea where I am. I'm in water. That's good. Water's, water's not bad. It's not, it means I'm not in any immediate danger. 
Can I get out of the water is the real question. Getting out of the water is always the hard part. Getting into the water, that's the easy part. But getting out of the water... I don't think I'm gonna get out of the water. I also don't have no idea where I am. So I don't know, I could be like swimming into a wall for all I know. Oh, wait, what was that sound? That was a weird sound. Am I out? I'm out of the water. Wait, I'm back in the water. No, get back. No! No! How are we back in the water? No, no. Get out of the water. At least we get those That's what. That's what matters. That's like half the experience of playing a banjo game, is listening to the music. What was that? Whoa, what is that? That's a dangerous sound. You don't realize how long five minutes it. Am I in the water? I'm in the fucking water again. I'm out. I'm out of the water. All right, don't go back in the water. I'm in the water. Am I on that? Am I on that platform? Uh oh, I hear the bull. Uh oh. I don't have any invisibility things. That's the cow. Oh, oh, I hear him charging at me. Sir! Sir, stay where- I'm in the water again. Get out. Banjo, get out of the water. Get out of the water! Oh my god, get out of the freaking water. I don't want to be in the water anymore. I don't know how to swim, Banjo. Get out of the water. Why does it not happen five minutes? You don't realize how long five minutes is until you have to wear a blindfold and play a video game for five minutes. <laughs> oh, oh, what's this? Oh, that's me in the water again. How was I? How was I out of the water and then immediately back in the water? I don't understand what's that. Uh oh. I'm in the water again. Something's happening. What's happening? Gento! I didn't see how many it was. I just want to make sure it wasn't like somebody raiding. I want to make sure. Oh. Oh. Okay. Alright, let's see. Let's see how far we've made it. <laughs> Let's see what's going on in chat. That's the real question. What's happening in chat? Also, Jinto, thank you so much for those 15 biddies. <laughs> I feel your pain, so I want it to happen again. Yeah. It's going to be a long five minutes. <laughs> I have no idea what I was doing. Like, sometimes I was walking around, I could hear myself walking. And then, where the hell am I? Oh, um, I think I need either invisibility things or the bee to get those. I also think they die in the winter. I have no idea what I was doing. 
<laughs> I'm just amazed I didn't die. <laughs> Sir? <laughs> Sir, please, please don't attack me. I'm a, I'm a poor blindfolded bear. <laughs> Thank you so much for that, Jinto. <laughs> right, let's try this again. This opens the the summer the summer house or summer world not house I don't know why I said house I think it was because I was looking at the the little squirrel house here I think there's squirrels aren't they yeah Chomp you having like acorns I'll just eat a few more well I have a feeling that uh I have a feeling that Nabnut's gonna eat too many too many peanuts too many peanuts is bad for you, Navna. Trust me, I know from experience. I know from experience, Navna, you can't have too many peanuts. It's bad for your digestion. I don't know about that, but... <laughs> Big egg. <laughs> Bruh, me Irie, mighty eagle, need sleep now. Good, good night, Irie. I'll, I'll see you in the future, cause we're time travelers. I'm traveling bear and bird. Ooh, this looks real, uh, real iffy. Ooh. Oh my god. Oh my god, what is that ginger? Wait, how am I gonna get him? I don't think I can get him. I think I need to be the bee. We got our. Is that our first one? Yeah, it's our first one for this level. Can I like damage boost through and grab them? No. Oh yeah, I got him. There we go. Totally worth it. Um. I think there's anything else in the tree. But I think I can become the bee. Oh no, I can't. Because isn't he on, you go over there and he's like on, I'm sorry, I'm on vacation or something. Or is that in the summer? Oh, no, here he is. Oh, 25. Oh, I don't know where I got 12 from. I was really stuck on that it was 12 mumbo tokens that we needed here. I was way off. But I still have enough. And that's it. That's the last transformation of the game. Now we're a little bee. Look at us. 
Yeah, the B is the best transformation. Um, I think there's a way to use the B to get. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We can grab. Oh wait, maybe we can't. I know there's one that's just like chilling on a ledge somewhere. I know we can go in there. But I was sure there was a there was a jiggy that was just like chilling on a ledge. They were supposed to use Well maybe it's only in the summer. Cause I know we've gotta use the uh, the little leaf sprouts to get up to it. Or maybe it's only there. You become a bee in Tui, I think so. I think you become a bee in um Cloud Cloud Cuckoo Land. Alright, so maybe it's not, maybe you can't. I think you become a bee in Cloud Cuckoo Land. Land on top. There you go. There you go. One side. There we go. Buzz, hello, fat little bee. We Zubas are guarding Grunty's golden honey piece. We've been told there's a honey bear out there. Wait, do we... We don't have an attack as the bee. Oh, so there... We do still have to get in here as... Yeah, we do still have to get in here as... As Banjo. Maybe that happens in a different season? Like way up to. I think so. I'm trying to think if there's any others that are shared between the games, but I don't think there are. N64 flying controls leave a little to be uh, desired. Maybe this was the one I was thinking of. They need the B to get to. I'm trying to think of all the transformation. I'm pretty sure this is the only one that's shared between the two games. But, I mean, this is a really impressive one because you get to, like, literally fly everywhere. That's why they don't let you take it outside the season that you can get it in. Because it can it can almost literally break the game if you do. Or break the level, I should say. Hey, Abba! Abby, how you doing? Long time no see. How have you been, my friend? I'm doing fantastic. Thank you so much for asking. How have you been doing? It's always so good to see you, Abby. Oh, that's the bird. I was like, what the fuck is that sound? That's the bird sleeping up top. Um, I don't think there's anything else we can do in spring. I think we want to go to summer now. 
Inter Internet's hopefully gonna get resolved soon. Hell yeah, Abby! I'm really excited. I'm really excited. Are you planning on coming back to streaming once it does? Your phone works though, so you thought you'd pop in playing an old favorite. Hell yeah, this is my all time. My all time favorite game. Where do these go? Uh, they just climb up to that platform. I think that's how you have to get up in in the summer. Uh, getting like gonna hit the hay. Have a great night. Oh, Jinto, I'm sorry. I missed your message from a couple minutes ago. I hope you have a fantastic night if you haven't already headed off. I'm sorry for the delay, Jinto. Oh, we're dead. I'm sorry about that, but I hope you have a fantastic night, and thank you so much for hanging out. I really appreciate it. I don't think... Can we take the bee into summer? Oh, wait, maybe we can. I don't think we can. Oh, Abby, we've missed you, too. I'm so glad to get to talk to you. Yeah, no, it's gonna wear off. But I think that's everything we can do in, uh... Spring. So I think we I think we have to come on over to the summer. Irie hungry now need five caterpillars. Wow, Irie, you're so you're so demanding. You're so demanding. That is the weirdest noise. The the sound that those caterpillars make is the weirdest noise. go over here though because we want to go down here and smash up this boulder wow what strength come inside and I'll give you a reward you give us a reward I think we have to go back to spring now because I don't... Oh, maybe we can do it in fall. I don't think we can get to his house. Yeah, no, we can't get there. We gotta wait until the water's higher. So I think maybe we can do it in spring? I don't know if what we do in summer affects spring. Or does it only affect the seasons that are in the future? We need a hardware... need to hardware a direct connection. Hardwire a direct connection, but that should hopefully do the trick. But I recently found out there's ways to stream on... There are! Um, I don't know a ton about streaming on mobile. There are some folks in our community that do stream on mobile. I know um, Zane... I don't think any of them are here right now. I know Zane, Gavin, and somebody else told me that they stream from mobile. I'm not familiar with the process, but there are some folks that I know are in the community that stream from mobile. Uh, hardwire is definitely the way to go, though. I have everything in mind is hardwired up. I, I generally try to keep everything hardwired up just because it runs a lot smoother that way. Wi-Fi can just be, although Wi-Fi is Wi-Fi is great. It can it can be a little bit on the unpredictable side. Streamlabs has an app where you can add themes and stuff. I'm gonna mess with it. Hell yeah, Abby. If, um, if you need any help and you need me to reach out to any of those folks that do uh, mobile streaming, just let me know. We, uh, we've all got, always got your back, Abby. And I'm, oh, no, I'm down here. Oh, this is the worst place to be. No. No, this is the worst place to be. Ooh, art streams. Hell yeah, that sounds really awesome. That's really exciting. No, no. Yeah. Too hot for magic. Mumbo want sun tan. Mumbo, how about how about you get over yourself when you give me some magic? I'm the main character. <laughs> I'm the main character of the game, Mumbo. I don't think I need any more. Oh, no problem, Abby. We're we're happy to help out. We appreciate you. I appreciate everyone in this community. So where do you come back and everyone would be gone? No, we're not going anywhere. 
I hope we're not going anywhere. I, I happen to like it here. So I definitely hope I'm not going anywhere anytime soon. But no, you got, you got nothing to worry about. Um, how many cow oh, doesn't show me the caterpillars? I don't know if there's any more caterpillars in the tree. Oh, there's a caterpillar. Sir, can you please stop that so I can get this squeaky caterpillar? Why do they squeak? I don't understand why they squeak. So a stream loop for Hotline Wervo. Here you go, Hotline, you got a pack. You got a pack headed your way, Hotline Wervo. There you go, Hotline. I don't understand why the caterpillars squeak. You're up and do a long stream for your comeback. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, that's what it's all about. I still remember your uh, your 12-hour stream. And that was a lot of fun. So I'm really excited to see what you decide to do for your comeback stream. <laughs> Well, you finished the Pirates of the Caribbean Tall Tales in, in uh, Sea of Thieves. We uh, we played Sea of Thieves a couple times. We did a, a beardy bunch. But, oh, here we go. We're going to fight. We're going to fight the bees. Bees. Prepare yourselves. We're here. And we're here to fight. No! I think he's the last one. There we go. Not the bees! Anything but the bees! Oh, you're getting bored. Oh, that's that sounds exactly like what a loser would say. That was a great stream. I'm really glad that others enjoyed it. Me too! I'm always... Anytime anyone uh, enjoys, enjoys a stream, I'm always really happy. So I'm really glad that you had like, such an outpouring of support for the 12-hour stream, because that's what it's all about. It's all about just having folks having fun, and as long as you're having fun, too, because that's important, too. But yeah, that was a really fun stream. Not the bees, anything but the bees. Whoa, that was close. All right, I think that's, that's the last squeaky caterpillar. I don't know, understand why it squeaks. Ooh. Ooh. Can I get that yet, or do I have to wait? Camera? Can I? Oh, I don't know. Oh, there's a bad life. Oh! Thought it was a bad life choice, but we got it. Yep, I, I knew that was gonna happen. <laughs> I knew that was gonna happen. <laughs> Getting across there without any issues the first time was just too good to be true. Oh, we're we gonna have to collect the caterpillars again. Or do they stay? Yeah, yeah listen, listen, Irie, I'm working on it. They stay? No, they don't. I gotta collect all the caterpillars again. Um, there's two. There's three on the ground and then two in the tree. One is down in here. There's one I see it, and then the other one's over by Mumbo's. Oh, come on. 
Oh, this doesn't say- oh! Oh shit, I didn't realize that doesn't stay broken. Okay. So if we die, we gotta make sure we break that again. That should be jigging- no, I can't get this way. That should be jigging number- f Wait, do I hear another one? What's up there? Where is it? Are there more than five caterpillars? Gotta take it slow and avoid the birds. I'm trying to go fast, and that's what happens when you rush. You're afraid you're gonna feel weird since now I have other people in the house with me. Um, yeah, I I could definitely see it being a little bit of a of a learning or like a, an adjustment curve to get used to that. Um, I would I would be like upfront with them. Oh, there's more than f there's tons of caterpillars. Wait, they did say they wanted five caterpillars, right? Because there's like seven caterpillars. Yeah, yeah, I I could definitely see that because you're like you're talking and you're talking to people. Um, I can definitely see that being a different vibe. Uh, but I mean, I would be, I would be forthright with them that like you're streaming, and this is what you're doing, that kind of thing. So they're, the folks in 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 your house aren't wondering what's going on and who you're talking to. So we've already got five caterpillars. Are there, are there more than? Do I, I thought that Irie said they wanted five caterpillars. Are there more than five? It just give us gives us extra caterpillars. No, it's one. Oh, okay, it is still there. I'm gonna grab these two just in case it's seven caterpillars that we need. Because if we get up there and it turns out it's seven, I'm going to be angry at myself. That jump always makes me real nervous. Oh, whoa. Freaking camera, stop. Oh, there's a jiggy deal. Oh, okay, I'll have to keep that. I'm up here already. I'll keep that in mind. That's the one I was thinking of. That I was trying to get as the as the bee in the spring, but I guess it's not there until the summer. Oh no, Nabnut! Nabnut's eating too many acorns. I've got none left for next winter now. Whatever will I do? Maybe you shouldn't have eaten so many acorns. <laughs> Nabnut, <laughs> what were you thinking? <laughs> There's also, isn't there another thing? There's a thing up there. How do I get up to that? I think that's like another way in. I think there's something in there. Uh, 
Uh, you're sure it'll be okay? You also stream in the evening. Yeah, that way, hopefully, you'll be streaming when, like, not not too many folks are around. You don't have to worry about being bothered or having folks interrupt the stream, that kind of deal. I'm excited. I'm excited for your your grand return to Twitch. I'm really excited. Why are there so many caterpillars? I thought it just said no, no, you piece of shit. No! I'm all the way back down here! God damn it! What an asshole! What is this? That's a Jinjo! Uh, I have! I, uh, I played Conquerors when the, the Rare Replay Collection. I've never played it on stream, so it's one I definitely like to play on stream at some point. I'm determined to get these freaking caterpillars to this bird up here. Right, so this is where that jiggy is. No. No, come on, why? Oh. All right, I'm gonna do a backflip this time. At least we didn't take damage. Get out of here, oh. Get out of here, bird! Backflip. Oh. Backflip. Now let's do, I don't think it's a backflip. There we go. So precarious. No, oh, we made it. Oh my god, if we got over here and that bird knocked me off, I would have been so mad. Get out of here, bird! Where does this go? Up here. I think this is gonna take us back toward where we were. Okay, so we're here now. Please don't wildly flip around this time, camera. Yeah, I would definitely, I definitely want to play Conquers at some point. I've been playing a lot of rare games because we're also doing Donkey Kong 64 for our throwback day on Tuesdays. So I don't want to I don't want to pile another another rare game onto the right onto the stream, but I definitely want to play some Conquerors at some point. Oh, are you kidding me? They've got freaking birds now. I'm getting I'm getting a little bit salty. Here, here's your freaking caterpillars. Here you go. You want three more? I got three more for dessert. <laughs> oh, freaking, freaking I are going back to sleep. I'm out here doing all the work, getting you your caterpillars, and you're just going to go back to sleep. I see how it is. Irie could at least help us. I don't know if there's anything else up here this summer. <gasps> oh no, no! <laughs> God damn it! I don't think there's anything else up there in the summer. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hope that there's not. Um, we're gonna. 
What are we gonna do? We're gonna go. Let's go to the fall. <laughs> Let's go to the fall. Do the ones from before carry over? Do the three extras I had from before carry over? Do I need eight? Hey, sir, leave me alone. I'm just trying to live my life over here. Here you are, at last! I've been waiting for you, waiting months to give you this. Alright, so that's six. Jinjos are seven, bird is eight. I think there's a, like, a, a plant that we need to plant? I don't know how that works. Oh, I do know, it's freaking eggs. I gotta go back to the spring and plant the plant. I forgot about that. It's eggs. You, you shoot eggs into the hole. Uh, Alright, we're gonna do the bird. That's nine. So what's the one that we're missing? I wonder if we can... Can we plant in the... In the fall, or does it have to be planted in the spring? Oh, they do carry over. Hell yeah. The last one's probably winter. You know, it has to be done. I'm pretty sure it has to be done in the, uh, in the spring. transform here. Mumbo busy, sweep many leaves. Oh, we can't transform here. Oh, I thought we were able to transform in the winter, in the, in the autumn. So the spring is the only season we're able to transform in. I thought it was the spring and the autumn that we were able to transform. Lizzie Hart. Thank you so much, Abby. Who's over there? That's a flying pad. Wait, how do we get rid of those? That's a flying pad he has on them. I, 
like a flying pad for these. That would make things so much easier. Oh, I'm not gonna make it. I wonder if that's a winter thing. I think maybe that's a winter thing. This makes you excited for fall. I love the fall. When all the leaves change, it's so pretty. I mean, it's it's coming up fast. It's already almost September. We're a couple days away from September now. I really like the fall too, so I'm I'm on board for that. Well, how do we get those? So we can't become the bird. How do I get those? I don't have any feathers. Oh, there's a feather. I might have to get to go grab. I see a feather over there. Yeah, Life is Strange 3 is coming out soon. It's real exciting. Uh oh, this is not where I want to be. Uh oh. Uh, we gotta we gotta use that to get those notes. Hopefully there's not like a bunch of those. Oh, there's another one over here. I mean this is the only thing I can think to do. Uh-oh. Right. Damage boost in there! No, fuck. Oh no, does that reset Irie? Oh no! Oh, yeah, the third one comes out real soon. It's, uh. Aw, oh, crap. Do we have to do Irie all over again? It's called Life in Color, I believe. They don't really give you any. any, uh, gold feathers. Oh, we, okay, okay. Oh, get get ten. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Who? It still counts. I lost all my caterpillars though, but that's okay. We'll we'll find more. How am I supposed to get these, sir? Sir, stop it! I just I just need those notes. Give give me those notes. Give them to me! <laughs> nah, I'm gonna be okay. I just have no idea how to get those. Oh, I also need... I mean, I guess I'm supposed to use the invisibility things, but it's not giving me the feathers for them, for it in here. Right, we need we need ten. Oh, there's one. We just gotta like get in there and get all of them. No, let me in. No, let me let me grab no, come on! Come on, just let me No, you fuck, let me grab the last one. Thank you. <laughs> oh no, that's a game over.
<laughs> I mean, at least we get to we get to see Hot Grunty. That um, that that confused the brain of childhood me. <laughs> I don't know if I'm the only one. <laughs> The true final boss, Tootie. Alright, let's try this. Yeah, I get, I get it. Game over. Why are you playing it twice? Just rubbing salt in the wound. Ninety-four jigsaw pieces. That's almost all of them. Did that refill? It doesn't. Why? Why does nothing refill our invincibility feathers? <laughs> Even Smash Brothers fills them after you die. Come on, Banjo. <laughs> A jiggy there. Okay, so that's the, the one I'm missing. Well, one of the two that I'm missing, but I think the other one is for a switch in. Have I ever seen un Unsolved Mysteries? Yeah, Unsolved Mysteries is really good. Yeah, is there a. Uh... What, what do you mean, Boomer? I'm pretty sure Unsolved Mysteries is on Netflix now. Oh, Good Mystical Morning made a, made a video on it. Ooh, that sounds interesting. I'll have to check it out, Sleepy. Thanks for giving me the heads up. I haven't watched the Good Mythical Morning video in a while. I'm I'm always into weird stuff like that, Sleepy. <laughs> oh no, stop. Please stop slapping me. Oh, like that. What, what is that broadcast where it was like, they were in like a weird mask? Yeah, 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 yeah. I know what you're talking about. I've seen, I've seen a lot of videos. There's, um, there's a channel on YouTube. I think it's, it's Rainbot, R-E-I-G-N-B-O-T. And she does a lot of like unsolved mysteries and that kind of stuff. It's really cool. So if you're into that kind of stuff, um, Nightmind is also another really good one on YouTube. That does like weird unsolved mysteries and like just weird stuff like that yeah I love that kind of stuff right, we got one Think was there one? I think there was one in Mumbo's house, Caterpillar. Yeah, 
Yeah, there's a squeaky caterpillar. Go up, go up, go up, up, on, go, go up, on. During Handy Manny, Leo and Stitch and the Super Bowl all got hacked. And porn was put on the air. Whoa! That's wild. How long ago did this happen, Sleepy? Are they, like, recent things, or...? Oh, the Iceberg videos. I I was really into the Iceberg videos for a little while. The Iceberg videos were really interesting. I, I think the Iceberg videos are starting to get old. Because there's, like, Iceberg videos for everything at this point. Handy Manny was in 2007. Well, that's not even that long ago. No, there's nothing wrong with that, Sleepy. You gotta, you gotta enjoy what you enjoy. There's nothing wrong with that. I'm glad that you're, in, you're enjoying those videos. That's what it's all about, just watching the things that you enjoy. Oh, come on, grab the freaking banjo! Banjo! There we go. It's my personal favorite. Let's, I'm gonna scroll, I'm gonna hover over it. Cartoon Networks gets hacked and interrupted by blank. I'll have to check that out after the stream, Sleepy. Because that kind of stuff is really interesting to me, too. I'm sorry, Sleepy. I'm drawing a blank on what BO2 stands for. You put it in your memes channel a while ago. Um. Oh, Black Ops 2. Okay. All right. Very cool. I will. I will definitely take a look after wrapping up today because I definitely want to check out that video. Thank you, Sleepy. Oh, you've been watching a lot of Wang. Wang does some really, some really interesting videos of some weird stuff that happens on the internet. If I'm thinking of the same Wang Night Owl, I also enjoy those videos. I have fallen down a dangerous hole of watching uh, Pokemon card unboxings recently. Is there any reason to climb this now? It seems so much more precarious. Ah. Uh. Dr. Skipper. I'm not familiar with Dr. Skipper. Oh my god, this is this is a nightmare. I don't know if there's any reason to go over there in the like, is there anything over there that's different? I guess we can climb in if, if we see anything over there. Because we're going to wrap around. Is there a squeaky? Yeah, there's one over there. Thank you so much for the work, Sleepy. I really appreciate it. here. Thanks, bud. Ooh, Reddit mist. Any, almost any kind of mystery is, is worth a watch for me. It's always fun to speculate on a mystery. 
<laughs> four is chilling, not four. <laughs> Anyone but four. <laughs> Uh, I don't think there's anything down there for us in this season. So there's no reason to climb those precarious leaves. Sir, why are you here? Sir, oh no, why? Get the hell out of here. Also watch a lot of criminal stuff. Um, like unsolved mysteries kind of thing, like unsolved crimes. Not mysteries, but crimes. Oh, look at him, he's sad. Hi there, bear buddy. I need six more acorns before winter comes. Have you seen any? Nope, you're shit out of luck. Oh, oh, wait, where does this go? You're shit out of luck, little squirrel. You shouldn't have eaten all your acorns in the spring. Oh, oh, oh I think this is where the last one is. Where's that sound? Oh, no, never mind. There's an acorn in here. Damn it. I thought this was where the... Oh, the, this, he is the last one. I didn't take him into account. He's the last one. So it's bird, plant, gingos, and... Is that it? Is there four more? Yeah, there's four more. It's, it's bird, plant, gingos, and squirrel. Those are the last four. How many more do you need? Mmm, Hamnut hasn't got enough acorns yet. Keep looking. Oh, there's one down there. They're all in really precarious places. Like, look at this one. No. No, why is he out there? No. No. Can I, like, oh, I can, like, if I jump and grab him and I fall. There we go. Oh, my God. That was so perfect. Oh my god, I could not have planned that more perfectly. <laughs> Sir, if you knock me off here, we're gonna have we're gonna have a problem. You're gonna have that. This is shit. Keep looking. You look. You just stand in there. Come help me look. Oh no, Abby, that's okay. No worries. You got nothing to worry about. All right, was it? Oh, I think it was five he wanted. Where's the last one? Well, you know what? I think we can go into that room. I also don't think we found any... Is it enough? Nabnut. Nabnut, go find your own freaking acorns. Maybe there's some in your house. Do you look in your house? Uh, on YouTube goes through the interrogation. Ooh, JC, JCS on YouTube. Ooh, I'll have to check that out. Oh, there's one... Buddy! There's one in your freaking house. You clearly weren't even looking. Also, oh, that's it. We got ten. Hell yeah, buddy. You clearly weren't even looking. Wait, what? Do you, what do you mean? Wasn't that five? What? What? Wait, what? Can I not? Did I not grab the one in here? What? No, what ha one of them disappeared. Because I got... There was two over here, one down there, one in the attic, and then one in his house. There were five. Was it not five? How many does he need? 
How many does he freaking need? I thought it was five. Is it six? I'm pretty sure the game just cheated me out of a nut. One, two. Name that house of flame outside return. Oh, six. Oh, it's six. Never mind. Like if you have seen the shirts that say bloodstains are red, ultraviolet lights are blue, I've watched enough crime shows that <laughs> they will never find you. That's you. I'm not worried, Lily. I'm sure I'll never, I'll never piss you off enough during, during phasmophobia to make you want to murder me. <laughs> Where is the last one? I bet it's up here. Oh, freaking birds! Hotline. Oh no, Hotline! What? What's wrong? <laughs> what's wrong, Hotline? <laughs> Phasma was a lot of fun. I'm really glad we played. We should do it again next weekend. If you're if you're free on Saturday, because I know Saturday's your day off now. All right here you go, bird. He's running your psycho ass. <laughs> no, no, no. Lily would never. Lily would never hurt a fly. I trust Lily. Oh my god, I gotta feed each individual caterpillar. Lily wouldn't hurt a fly. I trust Lily. Let me are gonna take a nap. Oh, is that the wait? Is that the last nut behind him? You're soon gonna be a big bird. I thought the last nut was back here. Where's the last nut? Probably like at the top of the freaking mountain. Or the top of the tree. Yeah, especially in this day and age, Night Owl, with all, like, the, the new, like, technological advances and, and forensics and all that kind of stuff, it would be so hard to get away with anything like that. Oh, this guy's up here. Oh, no, he's gonna have freaking... Oh, he's gonna... No, okay, he doesn't have music notes. Wait, there's not? Where's the last nut? Follow the path up the window on the left, break through the end of the room, swim down the acre on the bottom, walk up the center path, and walk to the other side of the circular path. Back flip to reach the first, jump from the left side, and let the center grab the acorn in the middle. You land on a different structure with another acorn. Walk down the platform to your left, turn to the right, use the talent trot to carefully grab. So enter Nabnut's nut house. In the window, we did that. Walk down the platform on your left and turn to the right. Off the steep path. Oh, maybe that's the one I didn't do. Okay. Trixie, what 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 are you trying to steal? Or no, that's that's steel like like the metal. That's not the the steel crime. <laughs> I'm still, I'm still a little bit concerned, Trixie. <laughs> or 
Or is this is this an instance of you uh, you typing in the wrong chat again? Where? Oh, over here. Oh, it's right there. Oh God, why is it over there? Oh my God, this is so precarious. Come on. Oh, there we go. <laughs> I'm on to you, Trixie. <laughs> oh, you're keeping my farm going. Oh, that's really sweet. Thank you, Trixie. Hopefully, hopefully the crops, hopefully the crops benefit you financially. <laughs> Hell yeah, you got this. Um, so we need three more. I gotta go back to spring and plant the, uh, I guess, like, the egg seeds. And then the bird, and then the gingos, which should all be in the winter. Oh, well, I was just gonna say, I don't know if I can, if I can survive jumping from here, but I guess we're doing it anyway. Oh, we're fine. I don't know if we got all the notes in here. I think we did. We're a couple notes short at the end. This level's gonna be a pain to figure out where we where we missed them. Serves you right, you freaking man-eating plants. You hairy fool! Come back in the spring! How dare you! How dare you call me a hairy fool! Wait, where was that ginger? I heard the ginger. That's the last one. Oh, he's on the roof. He's on the roof. Oh, I got a gamer pick. Oh, I want a gamer pick to spruce up my gamer profile. Oh, that's good. That's, that's really good. <laughs> I'm really glad that we got a gamer pro a gamer pick. <laughs> I don't- I don't think you could use those anymore. I don't think those are a thing anymore. <laughs> At least they were nice enough in the- in the final area to give us a flying pad. They're like, oh, you- You've climbed this st tree three times at this point. We'll finally just let you fly to the top. Oh, come on, hit him. We're gonna run out of feathers, and then we're not we're gonna have to climb the tree. Are you kidding me? Right, I don't know if there's even anything in here. I have a I have a bad feeling that um that's where one of the uh the honeycomb pieces is. Is that one? No, it's just a regular honeycomb piece. Oh, 
fly back up. Well, there's a bunch of stuff over there. Oh my god. These guys are such assholes. Oh my god, no! It's okay, we can get these. There's some notes over here. Alright, how do I... I can't freaking get him. What an asshole. Oh, I'm gonna fall. I'm gonna fall. I think we need to leave this level as the bee when we, when we finish. So I think we need to be the bee to grab that. Okay. I mean, I can fly too. I'm, I'm doing it right now. You're not as impressive as you think. Oh no, he pooped out the reward. Of course he pooped out the reward. So we gotta go plant the. We gotta go plant the tree. Sleepy.
Yeah, how are the icebergs? I don't think there's anything new in here. Oh god, I just walked in. You wanna see my paint Oh, look, it's Sleepy Alts. We haven't... We haven't been graced with the presence of Sleepy Alts in a while. It's been a while since we've seen Sleepy Alts. How is Sleepy Alts doing? Totally not Sleepy. It's definitely a completely different person. I can't see where we're falling at. because we're only missing a couple notes, which makes me nervous. Also, I want to see if we can... This this guy seems suspicious. Oh, you asshole. No! Oh. Fuck me. Oh, there's no... Ooh, there's notes over there. I feel like one of these guys has... A honeycomb in them. Oh, Sleepy Alts was in Peyton's stream earlier. Ooh. I'm almost dead. I'm out of freaking fat. Are you kidding me? I think the last of the notes are here, but I can freaking fly now. <laughs> Let's go plant the tree, because we're going to have to come back here anyway. I also think there's some feathers out here. Which door are they by? There they are. Oh, well, it's only four. Alright, so we gotta go to spring. Let's keep an eye out for red feathers. Well, this is not, this is not spring. Oh, that's fall. Oh, I was looking at the switch. I was looking at the switch. Not what was above the door. The Madman, thank you so much for that raid. Welcome on in, Raiders. How's everybody doing? How's everyone doing? Madman, how is your stream? Hey, Nat, welcome back. Oh, you told your friend Madman the raid. Hell yeah, thank you so much, Nat. Madman, how you doing? Oh, we're so happy to have you here. Thank you so much for, for joining us and for the raid. How is your stream? Oh, and thank you so much for the follow, Madman. I really appreciate that very much. Okay, so now we gotta come back in the summer. 
We just did some Stardew. Oh, hell yeah. Stardew is such an amazing game. That's such an amazing and a relaxing game. Pacific Ocean Plant. How you doing, my friend? Welcome on in. It's so good to see you. And so good to have you here. Yeah, Stardew, a Stardew Sunday sounds absolutely perfect, Mad Monk. That sounds like the absolute quintessential Sunday game. I mean, I could play Stardew any day of the week, but as a as a chill Sunday game, it, it just feels perfect. Let's refill the feathers out here. No, they don't come back. Alright, now we gotta go to summer. I forget what we have to do in the summer. I think there's something we have to do. Um, we can't go this way. Ah. Uh, but were those feathers I saw up there? We need feathers. Oh, hell yeah, that's what we need. Grab all these feathers. We got Manic Mondays, Tactical Tuesdays, Wild Wednesdays, Thirsty Thursday. Well, I want to know what happens on what happens on Thirsty Thursdays. <laughs> uh, something Friday, Spooky Saturday. Ooh, that sounds like it's right up my my alley. And Survival slash Slice of Life Sundays. Ooh, hell yeah. Hell yeah! Um, I'm trying to I'm trying to power through getting the last couple the last couple jiggies in this world before calling it a night. We're uh, we're almost all the way through, so I don't wanna I don't wanna stop in this world before. And then we'll do we'll do another banjo stream to fight the the final boss. But we're so close. We only need to get one more jiggy and like maybe eight more notes me too oh this is my all-time favorite game from my childhood thirsty thursdays every day <laughs> i know that feeling i know that feeling i think i think we're all living that that thirsty thursday life oh the the camels over here well you found it figured out a way to stream your sega hell yeah i grew up with the sega too no, Gobi, you're never you're never safe from us. You'll never be safe from us. I think now we have to go. Um, I think we have to go to the fall now to finish it off. Yeah, Sega Genesis. I grew up with the Sega Genesis. I, um, when we did, I did a 12-hour stream about two weeks ago to celebrate our, our 400 follower celebration. Um, and I, I found this crazy mod for the, the real early Sega Genesis Sonic games mm, that... Kobe Chaos, thank you so much for that follow. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much for stopping by and for following and for hanging out with us. But I found a, uh, a a mod for the old Sonic games that were you were essentially playing all four classic Genesis Sonic games at once, and every time you grabbed a ring in game, it switched you to a different game, and it was complete and total chaos. But it was it was the best kind of chaos. <laughs> Kobe, how you doing, my friend? It's so good to have you here. It's always so so good to have new folks hanging out with us over here. I I was able to do it for about for about um, two hours, and that was all I could take <laughs> in one sitting. Cause it, it starts to like I even threw up a uh, a flashing light advisory because it was really intense. There we go. Oh, there we go. Perfect. That's the last one. That's it! I'm off to the lava world! You sure? You sure you're not off to become a freak show in a carnival? 
I think you're gonna become a freak show in a carnival. Yeah, I've been I've been playing Donkey Kong. Oh god. I've been playing Donkey Kong 64 for so we do a throwback day every Tuesday. Um this has been kind of a bonus because we started this during the 12 hour stream. Why can't I get up there? Um, we started this during the 12 hour stream too. Uh, and we just haven't finished it yet. So this has been a little bit of a bonus that we've been. Why can't I land on that leaf? Can I land on this leaf? Oh, okay. What? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it, there's some real glitched leaves up there. <laughs> you still want want me to play the Sonic? Except the Thomas? I I'd, I'd be happy to. I'll have to look for it. I'll I'll track it down, Hotline. I'd be happy to play the. How do I get up there though? Maybe this isn't how I get up here. Oh, how do I get up there? Do I have to jump from somewhere? I can't fly in the, in the fall. Or do I come back in the winter? Oh, sir? Do I come back in the winter when it's dead? Maybe I have to come back in the winter when it's dead and it'll just be like on the ground. Let's try that. It was seeming like I could climb it, but now I'm not so sure. We're gonna come back. Yeah, I think I think that might be the case, Madman. I think a build of the mod in is in the video you put. Ooh, okay. I will definitely track it down, Hotline. If it's something that folks want to see, Sonic the Hedgehog, but everything's Thomas the Tank Engine. You better believe I'll play it. I'm I'm all about making the people happy. <laughs> oh my god, this game, when I was a kid, this game was, like, the top of the top. And this is, this is the HD remaster on the Xbox. This isn't even the original. Please be there. Oh, it's not there. It's it's not there. Is it? No, it's not there. All right, back to the the fall. Oh wait, well we've got feathers. We'll collect those. We ran out of feathers. There's some there's some notes we have to collect, but we ran out of feathers last time. I'm also pretty sure one of these snowmen have a have a honeycomb in them. Oh, there's some on top of the house. Well, these are gonna be really. There we go. Cool. And a, and I think. I think there's two. There's two in another section, so I think the last of them are here. Which means we didn't miss any anyway. We are still missing a honeycomb piece. Which part of me is almost sure is in one of these and if it's in one of the snowmen I think it's in the one up here oh wait where is the last of the are they up here I'm I'm almost positive there's one in this guy oh come on that was right on the spot oh what an asshole Oh, we're gonna run and hang out. Where are those? There's the last notes. We're gonna run out of feathers. Cause it, it could be in this one. No. Oh, oh god. Alright, 
One. Two. There we go. Alright, let's go back to the spring and figure out what to do. And then we'll figure out where the last... The, uh... The last... Honeycomb piece is. Because I think it's the last honeycomb piece in the game. But yeah, no, apparently the flower just dies in the winter. And who knows what happens to the, the jiggy. It just disappears. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Going back to the fall. Oh. In case we do need to bop that snowman. So how do we get up there? I'm trying to play Warhammer here, hearing the duck thing squeaking. Oh no! <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> it's just the fastest mode of transport in this game. How do I get... How do I get the rest of the way up there? Hmm. Unless... What's up above here? We probably... Oh, we gotta climb the tree. We gotta climb the tree and then jump on over. Luckily, this is the last one. Um, we do have to be go become a bee so we can get the last jigsaw piece in the hub world. But then that's it, then we'll have all the, all the jigsaw pieces in the whole game. This one? No. Okay. There we go. So. Alright, so if we all... Yep, see, so this is perfect. If we jump from the... Yeah. So I... Oh god, I don't want to go inside. There we go. Beautiful. I'm gonna take a peek at where the last. So we're not wandering around for an hour. Honeycomb piece one. During the winter, walk along the ice until you find a hole. Swim down to Naughty's home. A honeycomb piece waits inside for your effort. Oh, okay. I would have. I had no idea. All right, we're going back to the winner. Back to the winner. For the last honeycomb piece. got all the notes in the game now. And we're two away from having all the uh, the jiggies of the game. Or no, I'm sorry, we're one away from having all the jiggies. Hmm. 
So there's a hole in the ice. There we go. We're going to go through here and we're going to go to the beaver's house. We got to hurry because it, we use a lot more air. There it is. I didn't realize we can get under there. I should have. I should have been clued off by the fact that there was an extra life down here. There we go. So that's max health until we get something else later on before the final fight. myself drown because it's going to be the faster alternative to get back to the entrance. I know it's it's kind of sad <laughs> to drown Banjo for our convenience, but I'm going to do it. Oh, that's kind of dark. That's actually really dark. <laughs> All right, we're going back to the spring because we got to be a bee to get the last jiggy in the outside world. No worries, Hotline. Thank you so much. You have a fantastic night, my friend. After I grab this last, this la actual last Jiggy in the game, I'm going to be calling it a night, too. We'll, uh, we'll do the final boss another night. Because we've been, we've been live for over five hours now, which is usually our, our stopping point. Oh, thank you so much, Hotline. You have a fantastic evening, my friend. Thank you so much for hanging out. I always appreciate it. And I always like getting to talk to you, so you have a great night. Oh, that's not what I want to do, but it'll be fine. Turn me into a bee. Oh, I could have come back here, too. I didn't realize it. Oh, the flower would have stayed transformed back here, and I could have gotten it as a bee. Right, how's the stream going? I think it's been going fantastic. I think it's been going really fantastic. We've made a ton of progress. Uh, we were literally about to get the last collectible in the game. Um, and then the only thing left is going to be the final boss fight. But it's been, it's been a fantastic stream. There's been some absolutely amazing folks here hanging out, which I, I very much appreciate. And I've been having a ton of fun. So it's all just it's all just icing on the cake. And you're here too, and I really appreciate that. So thank you so much, Nat. It's up there. There it is. Come on. Come on. No, no. Land. There we go. There we go. There we go. So we officially got 10 out of 10 in the hub world. 
10 out of 10 in Mumbo's Mountain, and 10 out of 10 in Treasure Trove Cove, 10 out of 10 in Clanker's Cavern, 10 out of 10 in Bubble Gloop Swamp, 10 out of 10 in Freeze Easy Peak, 10 out of 10 in Gobi's Valley, 10 out of 10 in Mad Monster Mansion, 10 out of 10 in Rusty Bucket Bay, and 10 out of 10 in Click Clock Woods. And that, that's all the levels. So um, we've got all, all the Jigsaw puzzles. Um, we just have like the end game, the final boss, and the end game stuff to do now. Which uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna save for a different stream. So this is where this is where I'm gonna call it a night for tonight. But this has been this has been absolutely fantastic. I'm so excited to play some more and to finish off the game. Uh, probably sometime next week. I'll probably throw some banjo on the schedule sometime next week to finish off that final boss and to uh that's about it honestly <laughs> that's the only thing that's left is the final boss so well there's a little there's a little section before the final boss so it's like little section if it was just the final boss i'd probably go do it right now but there's a there's like a quiz section beforehand that sometimes takes a little bit so um, I'm going to save it for a different stream. But thank you so much, everyone, for hanging out. I'm going to hop over onto Twitch, and we're going to see who, which of our lovely streamer friends is live right now. So we can we can hand off this wonderful group of folks and all these wonderful raids that we've gotten tonight onto one of our amazing streamer friends. Let's see who's online. And I like to, I like to scroll down to the bottom and see who's got who's got less viewers because i always like to show some support to the smaller streamers sleepy you made it back just in time for us to raid you made it back just in time for us to raid oh you know who we don't raid very often hang on let me just make sure there's nobody else uh, we don't raid Hamy gemelton that often i don't think we usually get the the opportunity is sin live are you sure Sin, I don't see. Oh, Sin, Sin's got 18 viewers. Um, Jamie's only got four. So I think we'll, I think we'll, I think we'll raid Jamie. So we're gonna do, we're gonna do Jamie tonight because we do, we do Sin every once in a while. We don't, we don't do Jamie too often. I think we've raided. Um, we could do Saint of Salem. So would we rather? We also haven't raided Saint in a while. So we could do one or the other. We could go either way. What is what is what is Salem playing? Is it Minecraft? Ah, oh, Mass Effect. Okay. Um. Well, yeah. Let's do. You know what? Let's do Salem. We haven't done Saint of Salem in a while. So I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna get the raid countdown started. Thank you so much, everyone, for hanging out. I really appreciate each and every one of you. Tomorrow. What are we playing? Oh, tomorrow's Beardy Bunch plays. We're going to be playing Rocket League with the boys, with the Beardy Bunch at 6 p.m. Eastern time. And then we're going to play something else later. Probably Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth in the evening. Uh, unless I just... Oh, maybe I'll... Maybe I'll finish off Banjo-Kazooie after the, the Beardy Bunch plays tomorrow. I don't know. I like to I like to keep you on your toes for what we're going to play after, after the Beardy Bunch. So, um... I'll, uh, I'll get back to you. Probably not Subnautica just yet, Sleepy. I'm, I've am i not been in a Subnautica mood. I've really not been in a Subnautica mood. That's why I've been kind of putting it off. But we are going to get into some more Subnautica. I have just haven't been feeling it. Like, I was going to put on the schedule this week, and I just wasn't feeling it this week. Um, I'm sorry about that, Sleepy. But we're definitely going to get back into some more Subnautica. Look into the game Find Yourself. Ooh. Uh, I am still going, but we're we're getting ready to raid as we speak, Martian. The game Find Yourself. Okay. Let me. Uh, I'm gonna jot that down. I have a little notepad here for recommended games. Find yourself. Okay. But yeah, we're uh, we're just getting ready to wrap up, Martian. And Madman, again, thank you so much for the raid. I really appreciate it, and I hope you had a fantastic time over here. I hope Warhammer's going really well for you. Um, it was it was amazing to get to meet you. So um, hopefully you enjoyed yourself, and I definitely enjoyed having you here. And I'm going to be throwing a follow back your way after I wrap up, and I'm going to be keeping an eye out for your next stream. Uh, a pack for Sleepy and a pack for Martian. A pack for Sleepy and a pack for Martian. You guys got it. Let me get a pack for Sleepy. I put you to sleep. Pack inbound. 
and Martian. Martian, do you know on on uh, on Stream Loot you still come up as the Martian Young? I started typing in Martian Legend God King or King God the one time, and it doesn't come up. You still come up as the Martian Young. I guess I guess Stream Loot just doesn't update their names. I'm not sure 100% why. It's real confusing. It's gonna be confusing if uh, if there's other folks that like join and they had a different username when they set up their stream loop. Oh no, Sleepy! I'm so sorry. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna check out that video, Sleepy. I'm real, I'm real excited. Oh, Billy told you. Okay, um, I'm gonna start the countdown because you guys know me. You know me. I'm gonna talk. I'll keep talking forever. That's how our 12-hour stream turned into a 14-hour stream. So I'm gonna start the raid to Saint of Salem, who's an amazing streamer. He's playing some Mass Effect. Um, let's go on over. Let's hit him with that glizzy raid. Let's spam those glizzy emotes if you got them. But most importantly, let's show some support and positivity and appreciation when we get over there, because that's what we're all about here. We're all about spreading good vibes across this wonderful amazing twitch platform that i feel so honored to have become a part of and i just i just really like the idea of us going in and being a, a beacon a beacon of goodness when we raid so um i'll see everybody on the other side of the raid i'll see everyone if you if you have to have some free time tomorrow we're gonna be playing some rocket league with the beardy bunch at you're right now i said it wait you said it what, what did you what what did you say oh the countdowns ran out i may not i may not hear what you said <laughs> uh, but have a fantastic night everybody oh nat nat is amazing so i'm sure i'm sure whatever it was oh did i oh i missed that i'm sorry nat i completely missed that nat is absolutely awesome so um i'll see everybody on the, the other side of the raid 10 seconds to raid see everybody over there